Hello again one and all, welcome back to another video. Today we're taking a look at Fritange, or Spider Frit, or whatever he wants to call himself, day in day out. Uh, Fritange we're going to stick with for this video. Um, who is a Griffin Gaming cult member and a dildo loving goofball, like the Gay Lord Mischief and, you know, all his little buddies and, you know, King Jong-un and that weird guy with the fox face or whatever. Those weirdos, right? Um, so he's in that little clique, you know, and, you know, the Griffin Gaming cult. And he did a video re reacting to my video before Halo Infinite launch. So we're going to take a look at that. But first, we're just going to go through, same as I did with Mr. Relaxed, and prove these guys don't even play video games, okay? So that's what I'm looking at here. Not only is this a piss poor fucking example of a Steam profile where he supposedly plays all his games because he's PC Master Race, because these people have no lives, but also, right, I'm saying this isn't a good ratio. He's got 201 games here, and he has 1,318 achievements. So if you split, if you say every game's got 50 achievements, which is an average for a game, well, most games have 50, some have 80, some have less. But an average is like 50 achievements per game. You get to a number there of like 10,000 achievements. So out of 10,000 possible achievements, he has 1,318. But then you've got to factor into the fact that you can play a game on Xbox and then it gives you the achievements on Steam. So you haven't even played that game on Steam. You've played it on a different console, like Halo, for instance, which he has played on Xbox from his Xbox profile. And then he just signs into it over here and boom, he gets the achievements over here. So that's like another 200 gamer score or whatever, 100 and something gamer score gone there from his um, achievement profile. So yeah, 930 gamer score, right? So that and 81 achievements there. And then the same applies to the MCC where the achievements go back and forth. So that's 47. So add that shit together and you take all of those off basically. So there's a good 150 odd gamer score there, you know, going missing, you know. And there's going to be other games too. So, you know, your 120 there or whatever it is, plus other games that also go backwards and forwards between different fucking devices and give you extra achievements. They don't count. So that that's not achievements unlocked on Steam. That's achievements you've unlocked on Xbox and then have been given to you on Steam. So we can deduct those off. Um, this is already exposed by King Thrust that he doesn't play Xbox, but he defends it. That's why he's got 3,000 gamer score, same as that relaxed guy. So why is he defending Xbox? It makes no sense. Um, it's literally not good. And his Halo gamer score hasn't moved since then, apparently. Um, so now, right, he has hit his games on Steam. People were saying that his last game played on Steam was Halo. I can't confirm that because he's now hiding his games. But we go to his Halo Tracker. And according to Halo Tracker, his last game on Halo was three months ago. So that means he hasn't played a game on the Xbox or on the PC for three months. But he's a gamer on PC. But he, you know, so according to the information I'm getting, he doesn't play video games. This is why I keep posting that to him, but he won't react right he doesn't play video games that's, that's that's the crux of my argument here you can look at the shit yourself you can find this guy's freaking profile and shit okay find it see for yourself right i'm not making this stuff up okay so that's the crux of that what i wanted to say and now we're going to take a look at the video so we now we've got a guy who we've established already as doesn't play video games doesn't care about Halo and is now bashing Halo on Twitter, which we're going to get to later if you've seen the link. But now we're going to look at the video, what he was saying before launch, because apparently before launch, he was saying the game was going to suck. Now he's just pretending that's what he was always saying. Okay, well, what did he say about my video? Are you ready for this? Right. I don't want to kill you with my, my fucking pony salt. I feel so guilty. Unless everybody has one more video they want to watch. Oh, okay, sure. Fine. No. Pony salt. Sounds like something an Xbox fanboy would say who's defending Xbox products because he's been defend they was defending Forza with King Frash and all that shit beforehand, right? So now we're going into my video. So King Frash already annihilated him. But I'm now going to annihilate him further because this is ridiculous. 
So we've got a guy that's clearly on drugs, shows himself here as a caricature with like a bong and shit. And now he's going to try and explain to me why I'm wrong about the game is not going to fail and do a really poor job of it. So this is going to be real funny. Okay. This is from November here. Okay. You're going to like this because I find this funny. Not bedtime, not bedtime. Someone fucking posted the YouTuber. Now that I remember what it is, or what they, now that I know what it is, we can continue with the stream. Well, how do you not remember what it is? Could it be you're on that much fucking meth? I mean, come on. It's X, G, L, L, X. Oh, I forgot to say thank you, Evil Phoenix, for leaving the uh, comment in here with the uh, timestamp. That's a big help. Thank you. Here we go. Oh, good nighting. <laughs> good nighting. No, people, people are like, oh, okay. For those that want to stick for one more, stick for one more. We'll try and make it quick, and then um, then we'll go to. Because you guys have no attention span. Bed. I'll just, I'll do one more. I'll do one more before everyone goes to bed. All right. Bet. All right. Let's do it. Let's do it. What let's is it? it Halo man. Infinite Campaign over. Re oh man, that's fucking long. Okay, we'll watch some of it, not the whole thing. Right, okay. Okay, so I've had a number of requests to take a look at Fuck! <laughs> Holy shit! Screw it! I'm glad I stayed around for this. Oh, this is gonna be good. So here's a guy that thinks the dislike ratio means something. I mean, straight away, that's fucking retarded. You've got to be like five years old. I mean, come on. How the hell does the dislike... You haven't even watched the video. You've disliked the video before you've even watched it. How do, you, how do you know what's going on there? You don't even know what the video is about, yet you've disliked it. This is what I'm saying. This is what I'm saying people do. They dislike without even watching it. Proof right there. This is going to be really fucking good. Thank you guys for reminding me who this is. Good buying. <laughs> well, it's going to be funny by the end, isn't it? When we're going to see the fucking dumb shit you're going to come out with. Never minding. <laughs> Everyone's like, I'm gonna go good nighting. Okay, go good nighting. Like, the tang is going down, man. This is gonna be funny. I'm gonna go, uh, I'm going to betting. <laughs> yeah, two year old comments. <laughs> I'm Let's betting. Get to the video. <laughs> Fine, Tink. Go to bed. Go to fucking bed, Tink. Go to goddamn bed, Tink. I don't want you anyway. Bye. Goodbye. All right. All right, one more bong rip. Yeah, hit that bong. Drugs are bad, man. I need the drugs, man. Oh, we go. We know, we know. Fine. One mooring. One mooring. Come on, BB. One more delivery. Come on, one last. get off your fucking drugs, get on the fucking video, come on, you balls. idiots. They give me energy. Alright. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. So we're like, screw it, I'm staying, yeah, come on. Tomorrow's Friday. Stay up a little, a little, a little, come on. You can show up to work late, hungover, you'll be fine. This uh, campaign overview. From what people have told me, it's exactly what I predicted. Line for line, word for word. Weird and then, weird. along with the stuff that I already predicted. So now he's going to say, this is going to contradict what he says later in the video, but he's going to make fun of my voice throughout the video, which I find hilarious because this guy sounds like his balls haven't even dropped yet. But uh, we'll just go with it because it's hilarious. It's also line for line, word for word. Word for word. show. So the leaks were right. <laughs> this is just like... We'll turn it up. This is They're all true. As we expected. So... It's pretty tragic that the hype train is so fucking high for this game because it's all downhill from here. Huh? Nearly two. Huh? <laughs> See? Oh, it's all downhill from here. Uh, huh? What? It's all downhill? How could that possibly be? And where we are now, no fucking split screen co op, no fucking game modes, no nothing. It's all downhill from here. Who was right? Your dumb ass with the drugs or me? See? Oh, but you said you weren't saying that before launch, huh? You weren't saying that before launch. <laughs> what? Two million fucking views here, hundred and thirty k likes. 
Oh and no. For what? Oh, Halo no. 5 had this kind of momentum. Um, yeah, now he's trying to say I'm upset or something. No, I'm just pointing out that the hype train is retarded because the game is going to fail. This is what I'm saying. The game's dead. I'm already convinced the game's dead. I know the game's dead. And you guys are liking the video and hyping it up like it's going to save fucking Halo or some bullshit. And we all know the result. It's him going into it. And look what happened. <laughs> Everybody! The hype train is going to be derailed. It's going to come. It's time to be waking upping. <laughs> waking upping. The hype train is going to be derailed. Hmm. Get your, go make your mar uh, coughing. Go uh, get your coffee so you can coughing a bit. Ra it's going to be one of those. Off the rails, isn't rails it? on December the eighth. The seven by the eyes. game. There's no way that nearly two million people know that there's no co-op at launch because they didn't watch that video go back and look at the numbers that watch that huh? video to this one who huh? what <laughs> this video has gone viral for some fucking reason now clear for some fucking reason it's because it's it's because it's fucking halo exactly it's because it's halo and it's being overhyped to the moon and it's going to fucking fail as we've now discovered that's why you're now pretending you said it was going to fail in the first place trust the catholic church more than 343i um it's like 343 promised stuff they couldn't even program no fucking shit or who fucking said that before launch uh, me so you were wrong um my enthusiasm has gone for forge why because it's fucking delayed and not on the launch of the game um what are you talking about here you can defend, go ahead and defend Halo all you want, but it still won't make the player count go up. No shit, idiot. So why were you fucking defending it before launch? Fanboying out over a garbage game that was never going to do anything. You guys are fucking retarded. I saw this shit before launch, so where is the apology? Where is the apology, sunshine? Go back to your drugs and get the fuck off fucking Halo because you shouldn't be talking about Halo because you never should have been talking about it in the first place because you don't fucking play Halo. Unbelievable. 343 has got more bailouts than Wall Street. Yeah, before this game came out. But you were quite happy to fucking advocate for it before launch. 10 year plan, didn't have a 3 month plan, who said that before launch, me, infinite has no hope at this point, who said that before launch, me, where is the apology, again, so that's enough of that shit, let's get back into the video, it's fucking huge, what do you mean for some fucking reason, yes it's hype, that's what I said, hype train, going to be derailed, that's what I just said, you don't even listen to what you're listening to, just listen to what I say. Hype train will be derailed. The video is hype. Pure hype. There's nothing nothing of substance in the game. That's what we're going to get into in the video. You've watched two minutes of the video. Not even that. And I've said, there's no reason to get hype for this game. And the hype train is going to be derailed. And I was right on both counts. So we've, we've not even entered the video yet. And yet here we are. You're wrong already. <laughs> Where is the apology? He's, he's what's the worst part is unlike King Thrash, he sounds intelligent by default because of his ox. Because I am intelligent, and King Thrash is more intelligent than you also because he predicted this shit was gonna fucking flop as well. Apparently, you can't see that shit somehow, some way, because you're so fucking dumb. Too much drugs, probably. But he's not. He just sounds intelligent by default, but he's not intelligent. He does not display Being well, as you've been wrong on all the accounts in the video so far, that would make you an idiot, not me. Actual intelligence. Clearly, there ain't that many people shitting on it. Now, before we even get into this, the footage they show in this is not in-engine footage. What? Which is confirmed by 343 themselves. Huh? So this is not actual huh? game in-game. What? So what? this is the snake oil of 343. This is not what the game's going to actually look like. So take everything you see and everything you hear. No split screen. Like, this guy really does think no split screen is going to hurt Halo that bad. 
He really thinks that. Well, there's a lot of fucking outrage about it now, isn't there? And you're happy to fucking go along with it now, now that the game's launched. But I was saying that shit before launch, and now people are outraged that there's no split-screen co-op. And that shit hurt Halo 5 as well. So I don't know what you're talking about. People buy the shit day one, and they can't play split-screen with their family. That's a problem for Halo, because it's historic. It doesn't matter in other games, because that feature never even existed in other games. But to Halo people, it matters a great deal. They want to play that shit on split screen. It's not a difficult concept to understand if you have a brain, okay? And 343 was promising split screen since 2018. So if you watch any of my older videos, that will be a recurring point because 343 promised it in 2018. And this is a 2021 video, okay? But obviously you don't watch my channel. You don't know anything about me but you have to lead into stuff that you don't even understand. The video isn't for your retarded ass. It's for my subscribers. You have to get that through your head. If you're going to watch somebody who you've never watched before, there might be recurring themes here that you're not used to understanding. I'm not going to repeat every time that 343 freaking promised this in 2018. I haven't got the time to repeat the same shit over and over. People get pissed off with it now. But this is why I have to do it, people. This is why I have to repeat myself. Because if I don't, these fucking goofballs make fucking hate pieces on you where they say, why is he saying this? Because I haven't clarified for something I said 9,000 times in 9,000 videos before. <laughs> That's funny. You're on this video with a huge grain of fucking salt, a whole fucking salt shaker, okay? You, no, motherfucker. You, you do not get to talk about salt in my goddamn territory. Fuck no. Well, there's salt now, isn't there, that you were fucking wrong. You're going to cry your eyes out when you fucking get to this fucking video, right? Because you're going to have to try and figure out how you're going to say that you were right all along, even though we can prove that you were wrong. We can go to your dumbass Twitter where you post dumbass things and retweet dumbass things, and we can just scroll down here. Ban 343 for making games. To Joe Biden, he tweeted. He tweeted that to Joe Biden. Um, yeah. So you were wrong. What you're defending this game, and attacking me for saying the game's going to fucking fail. That the hype train's going to be derailed. I was right, motherfucker. Where is the apology? This is my business, bitch. Keep your name. Don't talk about salt. Get off right. the drugs. Not in these streets. Get off the drugs. Let's see how this goes. I've watched like two seconds to set the video. Oh, Dr. Disrespect 2.0. Here we go. Again, Dr. Disrespect has got more fucking sense than you. And I don't even agree with like 90% of what he says. But he even predicted that Halo was going to fucking fail. He just had a different reason for it. But he did predict it would fail. So again, he's got more fucking common sense than you. The writing was on the wall for this shit from launch. Hello? My little pony, my sweet some pony. How can I possibly be a Sony pony when my I have more Xbox fucking games than anybody? So why now we, now I'm apparently I'm a Sony guy, right? Which is retarded in itself. Because PlayStation is probably my least played fucking console. But to this guy, if you bash a game, that automatically means you're on the other side. But if I say that he's an Xbox fanboy for defending it, well, that's just wrong. It doesn't make any sense. This guy is acting like an Xbox fanboy defending Halo. I am not acting fucking PlayStation fanboy in any way here. I'm just telling the fucking facts. The game is going to fail. The hype train is going to be derailed. The game's going to fucking die. That's what I was saying before launch. But my little pony, my name's for Tanga. I don't play games and I love dildos up my ass. With our Master Chief and Cortana, partners protecting humanity. Mm -hmm. But that is now a distant memory. Well, wasn't it a distant memory in Halo 5 when there's only three missions of the Master Chief and. Cortana's not fucking in the game apart from at the very end when she's going full SJW. <laughs> Ponies seriously think they can call out game. Ponies.
Biggest Halo fan in the world here. More fucking Halo gamer score than he's got on his entire fucking Xbox game accord. More gamer score than he's probably got on his entire fucking Steam game accord, right? And you can get Steam gamer score, but that means signing into true Steam, which these idiots don't do because they're not real gamers. They don't care about their Steam gamer score. They don't care about gamer score full stop because they're not gamers. Why would that be special to you? Fucking unlocking something in a game when you don't play video games or care about video games, right? No. What you've got to be is some kind of weird drama merchant idiot on YouTube and just fucking attack everybody even though you've got no fucking stake in anything or you don't you just don't care about anything. It goes beyond being an Xbox fanboy. It's just completely retarded, right? So why am I a pony? I got more Xbox time played than you or anybody that's watching this video on your fucking live stream. Um, how am I a Sony fanboy here? Where does that come from? Okay, this is mental, retarded, like, I've forgotten more about Halo than this guy ever knew, but apparently I'm a Sony fanboy. Okay, moving on. Like, I'm not going to keep addressing that because it's retarded. Games for SJW shit, motherfucker. Cortana was covered up in Halo 5. It was SJW. Everybody knows that, and she went fucking nuts. That was SJW as well. Everybody knows that. We've moved on from that. That was 2015. I was just making a point that the story sucked in Halo 5 and is probably going to suck in Halo Infinite. Newsflash, it did suck in Halo Infinite. It was just as bad. The what And SJW caught on and made a return twofold. So what are you talking about? You capped for The Last of Us 2. You literally cannot say shit. What? You capped for The Last of Us 2. I capped for The Last of Us 2? I, I capped for The Last of Us 2. So my, my videos against Master Grief on The Last of Us 2 are completely irrelevant then. The ones where I said the game fucking sucks ass and it's an SJW piece of shit, The Last of Us 2 is. Okay, so I was saying The Last of Us 2 was amazing according to this guy who... So he's just completely misrepresenting me altogether now. Like, I did not buy play i haven't even played the last of us fucking one to this day so i have no clue what he's talking about this guy's a fruit this guy likes dildos up his ass like seriously what are this, is the problem with this guy yet he can't admit that i was fucking right about halo i just let this shit slide if he just admitted i was right about halo i asked him like four five six seven eight times on twitter to say hey why haven't you apologized over halo because clearly i was right now that he's bashing the game publicly for everyone to see but you know i was gonna let all the fucking bullshit about being a sony pony and all that slide but not anymore man now we're calling your dumb ass out now you're gonna look like a fucking retard okay let's go next fucking screen i don't want to hear shit about sjw stuff i don't even know what the fuck he's talking about either about the sjw because you didn't play halo 5 genius because you're not a halo fan like uh okay whatever <laughs> Okay, whatever. You didn't play it. Moving on. Halo 5 is about locking the munch bunch. The munch bunch. So, what is this game trying to sell? Meaning it's a bunch of goofballs. Like you're a goofball. That's what they are. The munch bunch. A bunch of goofs. What is this game trying to set up? I don't understand. I don't understand. So you're saying the story's good? Because I'm, I'm saying the story... What is the story setting up here? What is this overview setting up? Because it's setting up a bad story. So I can see the game's going to have a bad story, right? And I was correct about that, right? So what are you trying to say? Why don't you analyze the video and see if the story's going to be any good? But you don't want to do that because you probably didn't even play the fucking campaign because you're one of those type of people, right? So why are you even doing a campaign overview reaction when you haven't played Halo 1, 2, 3, 4, Reach, 5... Halo Wars, Halo Wars 2, you haven't played any of those. So why are you going to be interested in the story of Halo Infinite? So why are you doing a campaign reaction? To then call me a Sony pony for saying that the Cortana was an SJW in Halo 5, which she in fact was, and then I defended Last of Us, which I never fucking played in the first place. I, I just... 
despair with these idiots, man. But they think they can get away with it, and then, like, months later, they just go, Oh, well, I always said the game was going to be shit. Oh, I never said it was going to be a success. Blah, 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 blah. And then, and then they just make themselves look even more fucking retarded. I mean, this is embarrassing. How can you show your face? How can you show your presence on fucking Twitter? You and Miss Chief and all them goofballs were wrong. I was right. Yet you continue... Now he's just like a full reversal. It's like, oh, well, uh, I, s- I said it was bad before launch. Uh, uh, blah, blah, blah. And then they just fucking, basically fucking blabbering fucking buffoons because they can't back up anything they've said. We've got them on video right here exposing themselves. Well, it's good that you don't understand because then it would give away a lot of the fucking story. No, I don't understand because there is no, there is no fucking substance here. The story is supposed, you're supposed to set something up with the first cutscene in the game, which is what these fucking trailers and shit have been leading up to, up to this point. They didn't set anything up. The game should set up the story with the opening cutscenes of the game. They didn't do that in any of the fucking shit they showed. So it, it's showing that there's a lack of content in the story, which ended up being fucking true. But you idiots can't read anything more than five seconds, you can't even look into something and try and figure out, well, what's going on here? And when I say I don't really have a clue what's going on here, because the writers of the story are not explaining it very well. And that's because they have nothing to show. But you guys are dumb. So you don't even look at it that way. You're just like, heard there, Sony Pony. <laughs> the only reason I'm apparently bashing this game is because I'm a Sony guy, which is completely retarded. That is retarded. Flat out dumb. We all saw my Series X unboxing, so why am I a Sony guy? I don't even own a PS5. So why why do these guys arrive at this? Because they don't do any fucking research about anybody they actually talk about. They just make shit up. It's retarded. The banished have risen, defeated our heroes, and taken control of the mysterious... Oh, XGLLX isn't PlayStation fanboy? Oh, he's not? Okay. You sure? Let me take a look at his channel. Jesus, was that so hard to look up before you started trying to rip into me? Very. So even your own fucking goofball fan base is calling your ass out for being a fucking idiot in your own stream. And yet you still don't backtrack. Amazing. Oh, he's a Halo guy. Wait, huh? Oh, okay. He's not a pony. My bad. I take that back. That's my L. He's a Halo guy, but uh, he just has a bad take. Really bad take. Or the correct take that came true. So you owe me an apology. Just like you apologize there. I'm not a Sony pony. Right? So you've apologized for that. Well done. Now you've got to apologize for the fact that I was correct in everything that I said about Halo Infinite before launch. The fact the story's going to be shit. The fact the fucking game's going to be shit. End of story. That sucks. I guess even Halo fans... I mean, yeah, Halo fans obviously do have bad takes. Especially the Bungie Halo. But people that don't hey, are Bungie fanboys. This guy doesn't even play Halo. Never played Halo in his life. Where's his classic Halo games? Where's that shit on his fucking gamer card? Where is it? Where's his 360 achievements? Where are they? He's got 3,000 gamers score on the Xbox. He's not a Halo guy. Nobody who sits around. And, and his MCC achievements are not even impressive either. He's got nothing on that card either. So what? why is he qualified to discuss Halo when he doesn't even play it? He hasn't played it now for three months. So what's he talking about? This is what I'm saying. These people are retarded. Halo fans. Okay. My L. He's not he's not an uh This whole video's an L. So fair enough. Whole fucking video SJW stuff though. (laughs) Because you haven't played Halo 5, you retard! You don't know what the story is in the game. You've not played it. That's blatantly obvious. So you don't know what the fuck I'm talking about because you haven't played the game. Hello? Why even tr- why discuss a campaign thing if you haven't played any of the fucking Halo campaigns? What would be the point in this? 
This is insane, man. This guy just. Oh, he's a 343 bad guy. Oh, he's one of those. That's even worse than being a. Oh, 343 bad guy. Well, let's go to the tweets. Uh, what's this? Um, ban 343 for making games and say, Oh, you're a 343 hater. Oh, you're one of those guys, Mr. Spider Frit, Mr. Ta oh, oh, well. Oh, oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, no. He's one of those people, guys. Oh, no. What an idiot. Oh, fuck. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, no. No, no, no. It's gonna be worse. Oh, no, it's gonna be so bad. Oh, no. Biden. Biden, what are you doing? With these guys? They live in a delusional world where they yeah. can fucking... Yeah, he lives in a delusional world. A delusional world. He literally treated Joe fucking Biden. Joe fucking Biden. I would, I'm not even that fucking crazy. I don't know what the If I'm crazy, what does that make this guy? Really? Come on now. Come on now. I've never tweeted Joe Biden and asked him to fucking get free for free out of the franchise. I'm sorry. I, I'm, I'm just saying that's crazy. Like, come the fuck on now. Seriously, dude. Oh, the free for free guys. You mean the guys before launch predicting that the game is going to be a failure and then they're right... And now you won't own up that you were wrong. Amazing. Bungie, it was Halo's best dev. <laughs> You've never played fucking Halo when Bungie was around. How old are you? Like fucking 15, 20 maybe? Tops, you never played that shit. You've got 3,000 gamer score. You have not played the classic Halo games and certainly didn't play them back in the day when they were new. So what are you talking about? You didn't even, you didn't even experience that shit. So when people say, hey, it was better back in the day, you want to listen to them. Do you know why? Because they were actually fucking there, you moron. You weren't. There might be something in it. Did you not think about that? No, because apparently everything is better now, even though literally nothing is better now at all. I just can't take those, those people serious. I just can't. But you can say it yourself. When, it, when the game fails, then you fucking tweet Joe Biden. You know what I'm saying? This is a fucking good one as well. Imagine if you played what you're capping for. Again, this is what you do. You didn't play Forza and you didn't play fucking Halo realistically. And now you're here going, and now you're here saying some other guy doesn't do that. Well, neither do you. You're all a bunch of fakes, man. This is what I'm saying about you. But you will not respond to me. You will not respond because you know I'm right. I never tweeted shit like this. I trust the Catholic Church more than I trust 343. Oh, you're one of those people. Oh, you're a 343 bashing person. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Amazing. Good night, Frit. Good night, Frit. Hope I can function tomorrow. You have a good night. Buenas noches, sir. Well, if you're watching this guy, you've got to be on drugs as well, haven't you? So he's, he's not going to have a good fucking night because he's fucking... You're, you're leading a real bad example here. I mean, like, you've got syringes and... I'm, I don't know how this is fucking allowed on YouTube, I'll be honest. Syringes, a bong, and a shed load of beer bottles. And this guy looking like he's about to fucking drop dead from an overdose. And, and, that, and that's okay. That's fine. Okay. Oh. Oh, boy. He's, he's bunging. He's a bungiest. I'm Not a bungiest. Free for free. Um, what we got here? Free for promise stuff they couldn't even program. No, you're just being a negative free for free person. You're a bungie fanboy, Tanga. What are you doing? The oh. shame. What a shame. Starting him like a car. Makes no sense. Master Chief. Generic Halo theme. We have a new mission, soldier. Generic. What's down there? How many guns do you need? All of them. Every single one. Now he's reacting to the trailer, not my reaction, which is just retarded. Bungie Boomer. <laughs> That's a good one. Yeah, Bungie Boomer. Yeah, Bungie Boomer. What else we got here? Um, let's go back to some of these. 343 has got more bailouts than Wall Street. Oh, you're just so negative to 343. I mean, they're great, right? I mean, it's obvious. I mean, come on. Why are you looking at my Xbox profile? It's a Steam profile where I play the most. Yeah, of course you do. And you don't play anything on that either. You certainly don't play fucking Halo. 
Ten year plan, didn't have a three month plan. Who said that before launch for Tange? Hmm? Where's the apology? Hmm? I'm wait waiting. I'm waiting. Alright. Shittier version of the Halo theme. There's the mower. There's. God damn! He's, he's one of those! He's one of those! Joe Biden! Cancel free for free! He's gone from all the fucking hype. He's done exactly what I've said. The hype train has been derailed. This video has been vindicated by this idiot. Thank you for vindicating us, you moron. Oh, man. Oh, no. No, no, no. Oh, no, no. Oh, no, no. Generic towers. In the biggest campaign to Generic towers. So now I'm going on while the open world is just going to be Assassin's Creed. That's there's nothing special about it, and that's exactly what it was. It was an Assassin's Creed game where you have little objectives scattered around in an open world. There you go. That's what I was saying here. Generic towers. That's what you got in the game. Yeah, the fucking towers. That was an objective more than once. In the campaign that's my point but this guy obviously hasn't played assassin's creed before because he doesn't play video games so he doesn't know what the fuck we're talking about here i bet every one of those towers is probably like got like um nothing in it yeah interior like levels inside <laughs> it looks i mean i don't know i wouldn't call it generic it looks like <laughs> And Classic Halo always had a very unique art style to it. <laughs> I like, I really like the architecture that they had, like the, art, the buildings and designs for the original Halo games. Not a big fan of what Bungie did. <laughs> no, they only had a massive success of uh, the best fucking games of all time, but obviously Free for Free are great. Oh, no, wait, you want Joe Biden to cancel them, mate? They didn't have a tenure plan, they didn't have a three month plan. 343 has done more damage to Halo than pro players. Yeah, yeah. But Bungie, oh, they were terrible. <laughs> Master Chief, and to oh, a new Spartan freedom in the most wide open and adventure filled Halo experience yet. Yourself, I'll drink water. Good idea. Good fucking idea. Hold on. Drink water. Get off the drugs. Get off the drugs, man. Okay. Got my water. I the water and my drugs. Yeah, man. Uh, that was good. The drugs, yeah, man. Thank you for telling me that. Let's go. Okay, yeah. We know all this already. The chief won't be alone on the journey. His first mission is to retrieve yeah. a new AI, codenamed The Weapon. Yeah, it's just caught on her again, but a new Mom, version. Where have you been? You know what, I take it back. Those are not syringes. They look like syringes, but they're those like little gas bottles that all the fucking chavs get when they're like, they, when they, you know, like those balloon fucking gases. I think that's what they are. Anyway, what's he going to say? I'm saying Cortana's going to be SJW again. That's the gist of it, right? Which is right. So what's he going to say? No. No. These are two different personalities. Two different uh, characters. You know, they're the same um, technology. It's Cortana. What are you talking about? That's retarded on a whole other level. <laughs> oh, oh my god. This guy's literally bitching about everything. Because the game is going to fail and it's a disaster waiting to happen. The campaign was not good. It was average at best, slightly better than Halo 5, but the story was worse than Halo 5. There's nothing redeeming about the campaign and there was no co-op at launch. There's nothing special about the campaign. It's just an Assassin's Creed wannabe game. That's a fact. And that you probably haven't even played the fucking campaign. Because you're one of those people. So what are you talking about? And now it's like free for free. You shouldn't be allowed to work on games. Well, guess what? The writing was on the wall here. So why couldn't you see it? You're an idiot. Everything. <laughs> Except she can't have boobs. Master Chief is searching for the Oh Correct. my fucking god, Cortana still has boobs. No, like, she doesn't. <laughs> no, she doesn't. Proving you've never played Halo in your life. This is just a different fucking looking character. No, it's Cortana. It's the same fucking, supposed to be the same fucking person. Just a diff a newer model. 
It's the same. You're just talking nonsense. It's a different looking AI. That's no, it. it's not. It's Cortana, you moron. That's why the Cortana later in the game looks the fucking same. Hello. Answer to a troubling question. There she is, see? With her That's fucking... Halo 5 Cortana. Which features for like two seconds in the game. She doesn't even look like that in the game. That's like in a, like a, a backward cutscene. That's not even in the game. That's what I was saying at the beginning of the video. You have to take it with a grain of salt because this shit wasn't even in the game. This was in a flashback in the game. It wasn't even... Cortana's... You don't even interact with Cortana until the last fucking cutscene. Fucking boobs. It's a the, 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 That's not what I'm talking about. You know full well what I'm talking about. Moving on. Fucking different looking character. Retard. No, you're a retard because you didn't play Halo 5. So you don't know what I'm talking about. That's the problem here. You don't play video games. You're a PC guy. So how would you have played Halo 5 if you're a PC guy? That means you can't have bought the original Xbox One. So unless you went back and played that shit recently, well, I'm guessing you don't even have Xbox hardware, right? Because you just play, you know, through Game Pass and whatever on PC. That's what I'm assuming if you're a quote-unquote PC guy, right? So that means you didn't play Halo 5. You can't have played Halo 5. So why... I'm trying to explain something on the basis of Halo 5. A game you didn't play, which makes you retarded on the matter by default because you've never fucking played it or watched any of the cutscenes or you don't give a shit about it. So again, what are you talking about? Well, this guy doesn't know because it was in Halo 5. I bet you anything, he fucking sits at parties and he's like, everybody's like fucking getting drunk, drinking beer. He's like, this alcohol is not entering my system at the right autobahn. Shut the fuck up. Get out of here. Get out of my fucking house. Why the hell would anybody want to go to a party with this guy? He's going to be stoned to his fucking eyeballs with, like, needles out of his fucking arm, spewing up all over the place. This guy's not going to be a fucking guy to be around in a fucking party. It's like, no wonder you've got people at parties going, oh my god, who the fuck are these weirdos? I'm, I'm, I, I fucking feel the same way if I was in a fucking house full of fucking druggies, fucking bonging up. What do you want to do that for? What a fucking waste of your life. Killing yourself with fucking substances. Brilliant. What a weirdo. Oh, all right, but I guess it's because you guys just don't understand my intellectual level and critique. Get the fuck out of here! You don't have an intellectual level. This is the thing. I'm not even trying to be smart. I'm just being... It's just common sense the game was going to fail. It's not... You don't have to be intelligent to understand it. You just have to not be a retard. That's what I'm saying. You don't have to be smart. It's not about being smart. It's about not being an idiot. You don't need to be a rocket scientist to understand the game is going to fail. You know, my subscribers understood the game was going to fail. Some of them were on the fence, but they still acknowledged that I was making some good fucking points. That's all you have to do. You don't even have to be all the way sold the game's going to fail, okay? You guys are all the way sold the game's going to be a success because apparently free-to-play is magic, and somehow that makes games succeed. But you were all completely wrong. So where is my apology, you idiot? <laughs> it's one of those. It is one of those. Oh, well, that sucks. Well, that sucks? What? what? I'm not a fan of that. I'm not... Can I not be a fan of something? I'm not a fan of that. That's... Oh, well, that sucks. What? So I have to like everything I'm being shown. At all times. Or I'm apparently... I was a Sony pony a minute ago. Now I'm a Halo fan. I have to like everything they spoon feed me. But I don't like this shit. I don't like the Wasp. For, for one, it's a shit vehicle. And I don't fucking like this fucking gameplay. I don't want to have fucking areas with fucking towers and fucking shit and bases to unlock. I don't want that. It's not Halo. What I want is the real shit. So this ain't Halo, right? I'm not hyped for this. And I didn't enjoy it at all. The parts I enjoyed were not these parts of the game. The fucking shitty open world. I am sick of open world games. They are terrible. Yeah, apparently I have to like him. Otherwise, some druggie is going to say, Oh, well. <laughs> Why? Uh, Halo 5 vehicles now. So excited for that. Is somewhere on Zeta Halo. Halo 5. I do not like Halo 5. I don't know why. And I don't like the Wasp. There you go. Done.
vehicles. That is, a, that is a, again, you haven't played Halo 5. That is a Halo 5 vehicle. End of discussion. Wonder, mystery, and danger. This game's not like Halo 5 at all. Here's a Halo 5 exclusive vehicle. Why? Why would you? Why would you ever want it to be Halo 5? I don't. That's the point. And they've already fucking turned into Halo 5 before this because this isn't the first fucking campaign fucking trailer we're analyzing this one particular video and what they've shown us is the one unsc flying vehicle that they show us and it's the only one currently in the game still is the fucking wasp the one no one fucking likes hello this guy is mental but the re half of his problem is he hasn't played halo 5 i mean it's not difficult really to understand he doesn't fucking play halo but then why would you make videos about halo I don't understand. It, it makes no sense. You're defending a product you don't even support. It makes no sense. <laughs> Why would you want it to... You got the... Oh my god, small pee-pee. You gotta go get the pee-pee training. Go get some pee-pee training. <laughs> this is what happens when you do drugs, kids. Do not do drugs. It is small energy. That sucked in that game. And at every turn, the banished are hunting Master Chief. And the he really says hardly anything. He's boring. Yawn. We this ain't a video for your dumb ass. There you go. We oh, oh, I was worried that we were not going to get to see this guy till the end because of this scene. But the latest preview, we got to see more of him. A little bit more. The of guy him. that's not Atriox. Because you didn't play Halo fucking Wars. Too, so you don't know what the fuck we're pissed off about on that regard either. The Atriox isn't in the fucking game. Even though they built him up in Halo Wars 2. So is there a Halo Wars 3 coming or not? And if they're not going to announce that, then it was a complete waste of time yet again. Building that character up if they're not going to make a Halo Wars 3 out of it. That's the only re redemption they can have with that character now. This guy should have been Atriox if they're not going to make a Halo Wars 3. It makes no sense. Room, so I'm like, uh, and, and in the flesh, so I can't wait. I'm like, yes, okay, good. Or maybe they were doing campaign DLC, but that's been fucking shelved now because the game's failed like we knew it would. Well, we knew it would, your dumbass didn't. They're not just gonna like make him like a last villain at the end kind of thing. That's literally what they do. <laughs> I'm not even joking. He just fucking stands around and talks to you, yeah, if you count that. But you know what normal people do? They skip that shit. Fuck that shit, because the story's garbage. 449 from Tall Guy Gaming UK. Keep it up. I crave salt. Worked all night. Well done, fanboy. Suck. Go have some fucking uh, egg, uh, beans and toast and have a nice breakfast in the morning. The banished army is spread across the surface, building fearsome strongholds and outposts with no one to stop them. Yeah. Now. Yeah, he was complaining about the wasp Sakura de Sakura da B. Because I don't like the wasp. Why does everybody have to like everything here? Why is this the I like everything in Halo Club, you fucking retards? But now it's oh Biden 343 you don't work on the game. What a bunch of retards, man. Seriously. Can't somebody not like a vehicle in the game? When they don't like it in the previous game and it functions exactly the same, so they've got an opinion on it based on a previous game that you didn't play. But you can't do that, apparently. Oh, you're complaining about the Wasp? What is this retarded shit? So no one can have an opinion that goes against yours at all for some reason. Okay. Genius. BD, he was complaining about the Wasp. Yeah, because it sucks. Oh my god. 200 sucks. rubes. From Dennis Lamov, hey man, the most fun thing soy me fans crying about Xbox better than PlayStation. Question equals how are you taking it for so long? I just I don't know. <laughs> he does drugs to cope, and it's not going well for him because he's making himself look an idiot. <laughs> oh my gosh, nothing worse than the bungee fanboys, yo. I know. Yeah, nothing worse than us. Um, yeah, 
The gone and cancelled split screen cut for Halo. How is Free Field still for getting funded? Well, I thought Sprint Screen didn't matter. I mean, you just said it in this video. No one cares about split screen. You really think split screen's going to affect the game? <laughs> this guy is boring. This guy's boring. Terrifying, and then he was put down with the world's weakest gun. Wow. So easily. Master Chief has been a hero, ready to fight and win against impossible odds. Chief, is that you? You're safe now. Yeah. They keep trying to hype up the fact that it's Master Chief because they fucked up royally in their fucking mind, 343, with Halo 5 by not having Master Chief as the main character and they believe that all the- Yes! Yeah! Wait till I finish the sentence. I said, and they believe that replacing Master Chief and replacing Spartan Lock and putting Master Chief as the main character is all they have to fix the game. And that's totally inaccurate. So you going, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. That is retarded. So now you're acting completely dumb. Wait till I finish the fucking sentence. You're an idiot. That's not going to fix the game. And guess what? It didn't fix the game, and now you're coming out with garbage like this, right? So I don't understand. How can you be this dumb? And how can you not apologize after everything I said came true? I mean, I know you were fucking off your face on drugs when you made this video, but you can go back and rewatch your own videos and go, hey, I was fucking wrong, because you were fucking wrong, right? I mean, it's blatant to see this. Yes! They're 100% fucked up doing that. Nobody gave a fuck about Locke. Neither did you, because you didn't play the game. Locke was so one-dimensional, so fucking boring, and such a bitch. So which video did you watch to inquire that information? Was it the App Man or something? Because you didn't play the game. I can guarantee that. I'm glad we, we, we are forgetting who Locke is. You didn't ever knew who he was. You never played the game. I don't know. I mean, I think his lore might remain in this game. But what do you mean? You don't know who he is or anything about him. You've not played Halo 5. But God, Locke sucked. Did he? Because you didn't play the game, so how do you know? You cannot outmaster Chief in his own game. Are you kidding me? What are you talking about? You never played Halo 5. And every time I bash Halo 5 in this game, I'm a bad person for doing so. I'm a free for free hating idiot, apparently, because I said I don't like the Wasp because it was in Halo 5, and I don't like the Wasp in Halo 5. Oh, well, he's attacking the Wasp. Oh, why does he want this game to be like Halo 5? No, I'm saying this game is like Halo 5, and that's why it sucks. Um, but yeah, um, split screen, yeah. Doesn't matter about split screen, but now, oh, free for free cancelled it. Bad people, oh, yeah. Uh, are you a Bungie fanboy, Pratange? Are you a Bungie fanboy? Oh, you're one of those people. Very clever. You, you gotta be master. This is a ma this is a master chiefing. He's master chiefing. Was ODST master chiefing? One of the most popular fucking games. More popular than fucking Halo Five. No. Was Halo Reach? Did I have master chief main character? No. Still very popular campaign and multiplayer. So the problems were not just Spartan fucking lock. That was the point I was making in the video. But you didn't play Halo Reach or DST, so you don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Master Keith. 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 The mistakes of Halo 5 are just because Master Chief is not the main character. Bonnie Ross said this, multiple people 343 have said this, that they fucked up with Halo 5 because of just the story. Ain't yes. Just the story. But that's wrong, Fritanga. You're a retard. That's not what I'm saying. I'm saying they're saying that, which is incorrect. That's not the reason the game failed. It's the ga gameplay. Yeah. What? And it's the live stream. What? Yeah, what? He doesn't even know what day it is, man. This is what we're up against here. He's like he's agreeing with me when I'm making the point that that isn't the case. He can't follow a sentence. Listen to me. You retarded drug addict. Listen, I'm saying, yes, the story was a problem in Halo 5, but it wasn't the only problem in Halo 5. And that's what 343 thought going into this game, which is why the gameplay is like Halo 5. That's why the live service model is like Halo 5, because there's nothing wrong with those, according to Bonnie Ross.
Now learn to count to three. One, two, three. Get off the drugs, man. They're fucking you up, man. Like, if you weren't fucked up already. Give this bullshit bit mole you're putting in the game. Again. Again? Yes, the live service model's coming back for this game. Yes. That's why you say things like this now. Infinite has no hope at this point. Yes, because of the live service garbage. C 10 year plan. Halo didn't have a three month plan. This is what I'm saying here. This is what I'm talking about. The live service. This is what we're talking about right fucking now. Listen. I was right. You were wrong. Dumbass. So, so what? They keep trying to hammer this like, oh, Master Chief's in the game. Yeah, brilliant. It, it's it's his game. It's, it's not his game. Halo isn't just Master Chief's fucking game. Hence Halo Reach, Halo ODST, and fucking Halo 5, yes. But there's been three Halo games, and Master Chief hasn't been the main character. So why is it his game? This shows you don't play fucking Halo, man. That's what it shows. You don't know what we're talking about. You can have a good Halo game without Master Chief in it. That's just a fucking fact. That's been done twice. ODST and Reach, two classic games. So what are you talking about? This shows a complete lack, disconnect from what you're talking about. That's what you're doing there. You're an idiot. You don't, you've never played ODST, you've never played Halo Reach, and you've never played Halo 5. That is your problem, right? So I'm trying to explain it from somebody who has played all the Halo games, who is an actual Halo fan, not somebody pretending for some reason to defend the game for some reason and just doing a load of drugs and just talking nonsense on YouTube. My arguments come from experience and just fucking generally knowing what I'm talking about. All right, where do your arguments come from? You pull them out of your ass. You go and listen to Griffin Gaming, the app man, fucking gay lord mischief, and these weirdos who don't have a fucking clue either. They know less than you do. And they haven't got the excuse of being on fucking drugs. It's his, it's his fucking game. It's his fucking game. It's his game. It's his game. I mean... Halo Reach, well, yeah, you're right, um, to uh, Dennis Lamont. Oh my god, somebody in the fucking comments called him the fuck out just like I did. Oh, what a surprise. Halo Reach was good without Chief, but... Right, there's my point right there. Counted, done, game over. You lost the argument, done. Like, they didn't, like, basically cuck Master Chief in his own game. You know, like they were trying to do with Halo 5. What, you mean in the game that I said was SJW? Hmm. That was terrible. I mean, this guy got cooked by his own brother. If we want to go there. King Frash exposed that shit too. Master Chief. Yeah, I don't know what he means by live service. Uh, uh, you don't know what I mean by live fucking service? I, I, have you been playing video games for more than a week? Do you? This is what I'm saying. He doesn't play video games. What do you mean, what is live service? What kind of dumb, nonsense, fucking retarded statement is that? How can you not know what live service is and be a gaming channel on YouTube? That's all video games are now. What do you mean, what is live fucking service? What fucking retarded statement is that? How can you be that retarded? Like, I was like trying to explain it to a fucking three-year-old who's never played a fucking game in their life. So I was like, oh, well, Fortnite is a live service. Then they look at me like I've got three heads. That's the level of intelligence here. We're talking about a fucking three-year-old's fucking level of intelligence because you, everybody knows what that is. That's been gaming for the last five years, the last two years, last ten minutes knows what live service is. If they've got a brain, so how can you not know what it is? That's insane. That's nuts. Because it's a multiplayer player. Like, what? It, I hate to say this. He's not that important. Correct. Like I was just saying. C. Halo ODST. C. Halo Reach. See. You see, I answer my own questions if people actually watch all the way through before commenting. 
So if you just shut the fuck up, Britanga, and let the video play, I will fucking instantly explain to you what I meant. There you go. It's there in the video. I didn't even remember saying that. But yeah, I qualified the argument with, hey, Halo Reach New DSC were good games without Master Chief in them. There you go. Yeah, those are good. Fucking Halo Wars. Another yeah. one. Okay, you can make Halo games without having Master Chief as the main character that are decent, right? But, but this is a main, 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 main <laughs> part of the main series right here. Like, no, it's not. I'm going to debate that right now. No, it fucking isn't. Where's the fucking continuing story? It doesn't carry on from Halo 5 at all. What fucking bullshit is that in the main series? Anybody could have played Master Chief in this game. He didn't need to be Master Chief. What does he fucking do? What characters does he interact with? The guy with the beard and the new Cortana? What do he fucking do? There's no, there's no interactions with anybody. There's no Sergeant Johnson. There's no Captain Keys. I know these characters are dead, but we had Lasky. What happened to him? We had Palmer. We had fucking Halsey. All these characters were not used in the game. Captain Del Rio, another ca character from Halo 4 that should have come back. The Didact could have come back. They, there's so much stuff they could have done here. They give you none of that. The Master Chief didn't even need to be the guy on the ring. It could have been anybody. And that's the truth. So what's he talking about? This is a con this is the mainline game. It doesn't even continue on. That was my point in this video. This game's not going to continue on from Halo 5. Where's the Guardian? Where's Cortana? Well, where's this? I'm saying, like, where's this in the game? Oh, well, and then they start arguing, like, well, Master Chief needs to be there. Why does Master Chief need to be there? But Lasky, Palmer, Halsey, Atriox, all these characters that we've been building up for over the last fucking five, six years, they don't need to be in the fucking game, do they? Well, that doesn't make any fucking sense, does it? What you're saying is bullshit. That's nonsense. This is the next next chapter in the Chief's story. It's not. It's not. It's it's like an Elseworld story. It's like fan fiction. It barely even connects to Halo at all. I don't know what you're talking about. You know, like that's that's what it is. Oh well. Oh fucking well. I mean, that's what people want. It's not what they want. No one was asking for this garbage. No one was asking for this garbage. The leaks were already out at this point as well. This is like at launch, close to launch or whatever. What is it? November, right? I don't know exactly when my video was. But the leaks were already out. We already knew it was going to be fucking shit. Because there's no fucking characters in the fucking leak. It doesn't talk about Halsey or anything in the leaks. We know they're not coming into the game. So we already know that going into this fucking overview, right? Good lord. Nobody wants to play the, the next Halo, like, full-on Halo main game. You don't want to play it anyway. You're not a Halo fan. Pain with no Master Chief. Right? I just disproved that. I disproved that already. Halo reached a success without the Master Chief, so it can be done. So you're talking bullshit. Halo reaching. He's Halo reaching for it. Halo reach. Halo reach was super popular, man. I don't know what you talk. It was so popular. It had like nine million fucking sales, and there was no Master Chief in the campaign. So what? What is the argument here? Just decent gameplay. Halo DST. Decent in fact, game. Reach sold more than Halo Four, where Master Chief was the main character. Gameplay. It can be done. Halo Five main character Sergeant Locke. Not a good gameplay, right? No. Yeah. Okay. But you, you could, that, yeah, the gameplay sucks. That's the problem with the game. That's what I'm talking about. Now you're making a Halo game with Master Chief with the shit gameplay from Halo 5. Correct. What's he going to say now? Oh, this game's not like Halo 5 because I've never played any Halo games in my life. The, the problem wasn't mm -hmm. that Master Chief wasn't the main character. Correct. And Master Chief is still in Halo 5. What was the main problem then? But it was one of the main problems yeah, for us. Three levels, but no, it wasn't because you don't care about Halo's story. Because you're not complaining before launch that where the fuck is Halsey? Where the fuck is the characters? You don't give a rat's ass. Where's your video on this? You're not attacking the game before launch. Only after launch, and then only after everybody else has already said, "Hey, where the fuck is the content?" Bit late for that, isn't it? When you're fucking asking Joe Biden and shit, like a fucking psychopath. 
Like, this is insane, brother. This is totally insane. This wouldn't be so bad if he just shut the fuck up about Halo, but he won't take it out of his fucking mouth, man. Halo 24 fucking 7, man. How many tweets are you going to make about fucking Halo? Hmm? How many tweets? How many? This is why I fucking started thinking I had to go back to this video. I had this saved. This is retarded, man. Why do you keep talking about it when you were totally for everything before launch? It doesn't make any sense. You're just making yourself look more of an idiot by not acknowledging I was correct. This is retarded. Now you've just turned it into Gears 5 gameplay where you just kind of roam, roam on a big map. You don't even have a mini map. See where you're going. And there's no this guy really should watch the new IGN campaign footage. <laughs> it's like Gears of War 5. That's a fact. It's a like Gears of War 5's campaign. That is a fact. It's got the relic weapons. It's got all that garbage. It's literally like Halo 5. That's why they brought the Gears 5 devs in to help with the game. <laughs> it shows a lot, a lot of new stuff that really brought me back. Like, oh, fuck. Okay, I have a little more faith in this game. Two dollars from Mad Gaming Mad. Well, you you've got enough faith in it to fucking say that I don't know what I'm talking about. That I'm a bungee fanboy. But now you're begging Joe Biden to shut free for free down. What happened? What went wrong? Who was right? At Locke also sucked as a leader in Halo Nightfall. Yeah. Yeah. Something else that for Tanga's not watched. Yeah, like playing it's like playing Doom without Doom Guy, you know? Doom without Doom Guy. Doom Guy doesn't even have a personality. He's just a suit of armor. He literally has no personality. Who does he interact with? What characters? Doom Doom Guy is literally just you in a suit. There is what do you mean Doom without Doom Guy? You could what what are you talking about? Doom without fucking Doom. That Doom doesn't have a protagonist. It doesn't have one. Doom Guy is just like a fan made name. He's not actually called Doom Guy. Someone made that up. Doesn't even have a name. That's the worst example of all time. That just proves my point that the fucking player's character is not the end all be all. That was my point, and I stand by it. And you just prove my point by saying Doom Guy, who has literally no fucking character whatsoever. He's liked how they call called Ma uh, Master Chief Devil, you know. Demon, you idiot. Play the game. It was just... <laughs> he really is like the Doom... He's the Doom Slayer. D, D... Demon is the word you're looking for. Play the game. Of the Halo franchise. No co-op. Did anybody have fun not... Have, not being the original Doom guy in fucking Doom 3? Did you have fun with... Nobody gives a fuck! Nobody cares. That. <laughs> Open area, no fucking corporate launch. And the undertones of, oh, we're making it like. Yeah, did. I swear to God, I, I thought I misheard him, but did he really? Yeah, he did say that Halo Infinite. Halo Infinite's gameplay is like Halo 5, but what? Yeah, yes, it is. Yes, funny enough. Like, you know, the slide, the clamber, the ADS. All that bullshit that's from Halo 5, you know? The Elgar aiming from Halo 5. You know, funny enough, it's like Halo 5. I know you don't like to hear that as a fucking Xbox fanboy or whatever you're supposed to be, but that's the truth. That's why the game failed, but here we are. No! No! No, no, no! No, no, no! No! no. They're not! They're not! No! No, it's not! This... No! Yeah. This is way more like more fucking drugs. Uh, Halo Combat Evolved, <laughs> but with an open world dynamic and more utilities for yeah, you know, yeah. I remember the grappling up from Halo One. Yeah. Halo Combat Evolved on fucking steroids. It's great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, see, Master this is the Chief. thing. Um, that's what Halo Five was. That's a, literally a quote from Free Four Free. They said it was. Halo on steroids. That was a quote in the 343 Halo 5 Sprint documentary. So you just literally said what 343 said about Halo 5. That describes the gameplay in Infinite. So there you go. Well done.
But obviously he didn't watch any of those documentaries. He didn't watch anything about Halo 5. You've not played Halo 5. You don't know anything about Halo 5. Or this game. Obviously. Like the yeah! Nobody wanted a Doom with no Doom guy. But when they, when they brought Doom Nobody cares, you moron! Who is Doom guy? What does he fucking do? He doesn't even speak! He doesn't do anything! What do you mean? Doom guy is not a character. He doesn't fucking. He doesn't even exist in your. He's exists in your mind. It's a fan made name. What do you mean, Doom guy? What's his real name? Master Chief is John, one one seven. He's a character. Doom doesn't have that. Previous Bungie devs criticized Doom for that reason. That the game's like, well, there's no story, man. It's just boom, you go to hell, fight the devil, and that's it. That's every fucking Doom game you've ever played. Halo isn't like that. It has a fucking arc story thing. Ha stuff happens. The, there is no Doom guy. He's not. He's he, he's a figment of your imagination. You are Doom guy. You are just. He's just a fucking character. He has no story at all. He has less story than Master Chief. Yeah. Oh well, would be so terrible if he was in the game. This is that. Hail LNG ODST fucking argument where he's like the protagonist is so amazing and he literally does nothing and says nothing the whole game. Doom get ba guy, guy back? Doom was fucking back. When they brought Doom guy back. That was because they changed the gameplay. Doom free gameplay was slower. Some people like that, some people didn't. Then they went back to try and make it more like old Doom where it was faster. It's more like Unreal Tournament and shit. That's gameplay changes. Nothing to do with the fucking character. No one gives a rat's ass about Doom Guy. I can't believe this shit. I can't believe the, the retarded arguments that come out of these people. I just don't get it. It was fucking... It was, it was good again. <laughs> they keep trying to hammer it home. Oh, because they changed Chief. the character. It's all Master Chief. It's Master Chief. And nothing Chief. else. We knew it was Master Chief in 2018 with the reveal. We yeah. knew it was Master Chief before yes. that. After the fucking interviews, uh -huh. if you actually give a shit about this stuff, with Bonnie Ross saying how they even admit themselves they fucked up with the campaign, the story. So we knew they were going to change it back to the Master Chief. Okay. Right? Because yeah. they all said Halo 4 was a success because of its story with the Master Chief and blah, blah, fucking blah. Okay, um, he's acting like... like Get to the point, Fratanga. Let me finish my fucking point. That's not a point. What are you arguing against? I haven't said anything yet. 343 set, set it up like Master Chief being there is like... The Get surprise. on with no, it! No, nobody... What? It's not a surprise What an idiot. Anybody. What a fucking <laughs> balloon. It was never set up to be a surprise. It's what people wanted. It's what they exactly, so get to the, to the point. I haven't it. finished yet. Right? 343 even acknowledge this, right? They don't acknowledge that it's Call of Duty gameplay and no one fucking wants to play it. But they do acknowledge the story part. This has been coming since 2016. Sort and, of. and now, oh, so you admit that I'm right? Thank you. That's all they can talk about. Oh my God, that's like that's all they're talking about. They're not talking about the gameplay because the gameplay still sucks ass. Point proven. Fucking saying, wow, The Last of Us Two has been in. Uh, fucking... What is he talking about? The Last of Us Two. Get off the drugs, man. When did The Last of Us One come out? Who cares? Oh my God. What's that got to do with Halo? That uh, The Last of Us 2 came out? God uh, fucking lord. Like fucking nearly eight something years ago. Um, <laughs> yeah, that's like saying, oh my god, The Last my of Us 2 was an eight pony, year development my cycle. Pony. It's like, what, you're going to say it was an eight year development cycle just because the initial idea of The Last of Us 2 started as soon as the first one was over? Where am I saying development cycle? I'm saying... They confirmed Master Chief was going to be in the next game from an interview in 2016. There's nothing but development. That's just the fucking Bonnie Ross saying that. What are you talking about, you moron? That means that game was an eight-year development. No, he's putting. I never even said this. I never said it. You said it. Changed. It's Halo Five, but now instead of playing as. Spartan lock for most of the game and the munch bunch you play as just master chief what happened to blue team fuck it what happened to black 
th these are all really good points. Where are they? They're not in the game. Ski and Palmer and what happened to all them? Fuck it. Reboot. Fucking Brohammers. This guy is so dumb he hasn't played Halo 5, so what I'm saying, he just keeps going, What? Huh? What? What is he talking about? What? Because he never played Halo 5. So what I'm saying does not make any sense to him. Or Halo 4, apparently. Because I'm talking about characters from Halo 4 and Halo 5 that are not in the game now, and he's like, What? Huh? Helps to play Halo 5, doesn't it? So you know what I'm talking about. Otherwise, stop going, huh, what, huh? Or don't respond to the video. Why, like I say, why respond to a campaign overview? What? Another, another you... shit character. <laughs> now, some of this, now, people will tell me that it's not in engine, it is an engine. Some of this looks in engine. It is. But it is. You know, it's, it's literally the game. And some of it isn't. And we can pick parts out of it that are not. Being played. It's literally the fucking game. Are you having trouble believing it looks this decent? <laughs> well, we all know the final game looked like fucking shit. So yeah, I'm having trouble that that is the actual game at times. Yes. Well, people told me before. So I'm going by what people told me before. But there's stuff in there that's like misrepresented. Like Cortana is not really in the game. She's in a cutscene. Free for free themselves have come out and said, this bit's not in engine, that bit's not in engine. So we can't believe what we're seeing here either way. Even if you think it looks like it's part of the game, we don't know that it is. Either it's all should be part of the game or none of it. Well, we saw the- That's, Isn't that a fair point? Engine gameplay thing, and yeah, this is, we saw them drive there. Yeah, this is in the game. It is, we saw them do it today. So we're halfway through, let's let's roll. Let's see what's what's coming next. Yeah, a reboot. He called it a reboot. Mate, it is a reboot, you moron. That's exactly what it is. They binned the entire story from Halo 5. So how is it not a fucking reboot, you fucking demented, drugged up fucking loser? What? How is it not a reboot? Because it doesn't say remaster or reboot on the fucking box. So we fucking, or they haven't told you that? This is retarded, man. Come on. Read between the fucking lines. Try and have a brain, really. What the hell? Why would you do that? It's a joke. It's a, it's a joke. It's a, are you a Halo fan? It's a fucking joke. Are you a Halo fan? Because you ain't fucking, don't have a clue what I'm talking about. Never played the games in your life. No game has score on Xbox, so I'm guessing not. So where's the joke? It's only a joke if you're a FIFA free loving retard. It's like, it's not funny. There's no joke there. Why would he drive off the cliff? It's a joke. To who? It isn't. Keep showing the grappling up. They're obsessed with this fucking- Dude! Because it's fucking tight! No, it's tight, is it? Yeah, well, they had a grappling hook in 007 Agent Under Fire on the freaking GameCube, but apparently we've got to keep fucking forcing it down your fucking throat. No, it was in the game and no one talks about that shit. You know why? Because no one fucking cares about grappling hooks. It's all hype. It's all bullshit. The grappling hook didn't save the game, did it? You fucking simpleton. You know, it would have saved the game. An actual decent campaign. Not one way you just grappling hook everywhere. Which takes the whole fucking point out of the vehicles and everything in the fucking game. You can grapple towards enemies, grapple objects, grapple away from them. It's like you can even fucking grapple items out of off of them. I think. Spoken like a true fucking dick riding idiot. Because that's not a Halo game, is it? There's no grappling hook in any other Halo game. So how is it like fucking CE? Like you just said two minutes before. This is like CE. There's nothing like CE. There's no fucking grappling hook in CE. What are you talking about? Think, like, you can grapple to fucking flying vehicles to... So what? The point is I don't care and neither does anybody else. Real Halo fans don't give a rat's ass. That's the point. We don't care. That's all they've got. There's nothing else to show. Fucking hijack them. It's clearly a, a whole new mechanic they added to it to spice up the gameplay.
putting emphasis to ruin the gameplay. Yeah. This is on it because it's cool. Like what? What do you want them to do? Not add new stuff and show it off? Gameplay they've created. I'm saying stop forcing it down our throats because no one gives a fuck about it. If it's still, if it's if something's genuinely epic and people actually find it cool, you can show it maybe once or twice and people are like, oh, that's cool. You don't need to show it 9,000 times. You're missing the whole fucking point. Is that they're just forcing this one thing down your throat because they've got nothing. There's nothing else to show. There's nothing cool about the game. In this game where you can hook things and you can throw objects and you can hook towards things and none of that appeals to me at all. Correct. <laughs> Oh yeah, God. but guess what? Where? What are you saying now? Oh, boohoo! Ten-year plan. Didn't even have a three-month plan. Boohoo! Oh, Joe Biden saved me. Three, four, three made a bad game. Oh, oh, the council split-screen co-op. How is three, four, three still getting funded? Oh, what a moron! It's like, can't I just like tell the truth beforehand that the fucking shit isn't appealing and no one cares about it? Because no one cared about it, did they? Because the game fucking died. <laughs> oh, the Bungie Halo fan doesn't like it. Hey, guys, in the chat, can we get tears? Aww. Aww. The Bungie Halo fan doesn't like it. Aww. Poor guy. Well, that really sucks. Oh, well. <laughs> And I, quite frankly, it's there's retarded. a number of Halo fans who fucking hate it the same as I do. So what's the fuck? Uh, where? Where? Well, you don't know any fucking Halo fans, do you? You've got no fucking friends. So how the fuck? You have to make friends on fucking YouTube because you've got none in real life. What, why would you want to associate with somebody in real life who's up to his eyeballs on drugs and drink all the fucking time? Spending all night fucking doing shit podcasts. Trashing Sony Pony is whatever the fuck he thinks he's doing. Where's the logic here? He's got no friends in real life. So he's going on about me. And it's like, you don't know anybody that like, that's saying this shit sucks. What about like everybody I know in actual real fucking life? Never mind the people on my fucking YouTube channel. They don't count apparently. I see overwhelming positive feedback. In point. You see hype. Like I said right at the fucking beginning of the video that you weren't listening to. There's a hype train that's going to be derailed. It was fucking derailed. We can see it. You were wrong. I was right. Where is the apology? You know, show me the real shit. Huh? Why is everything, every single piece of gameplay shown about this game... Someone grappling hooking somebody. Because it's fun and it's cool. To who? You haven't played the game in three fucking months. You haven't played the game in three fucking months. So if it's so fucking fun and cool and oh look at me. Why haven't you played the game in three months? Exactly. The game fucking sucks ass through a straw like I fucking said. The grappling hook is fun for a few fucking minutes like I fucking said. Nobody gives a shit about it. It's all fucking hype. Hype train derailed. Get Joe Biden to sort it out, apparently. Come on. That's why. It, 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 it's old, man. It's old news. We Correct. Uh, not for Halo? I mean... It's literally old news in Halo because they fucking showed it the year before. They haven't showed anything different in this fucking trailer that's exciting at all. They're showing the same shit they sold the year before. That's the point. This guy is slow. What? <laughs> oh my god. I've seen this a million times. Show something else. Come on. I mean, it's so old hat at this point. It's like, I'm going to be bored of it before I even play the game. This is... You're going to be bored of a mechanic before even using it? What? Because it's fucking on repeat 24-7. I'm bored of seeing it. My eyes are bored of seeing it before I even play the game. Yes, that's the thing. It's called burnout. You see the same fucking thing enough times. You're like, I'm so sick of seeing it. Like, can you not understand that? Why is that so hard to understand? 
What do we? We're such a oh, he's such a little bitch. Hey, again, he's we're... such a little bitch. Well, you, you're crying about it now. What does that make you? Ten year plan, three four three, done more damage to Halo than the pro players. Okay, are you a little bitch? That because that's your own standard. I'm quite happy for people to criticize three four three, but in your mind, people that do that are little bitches. So you are a little bitch by your own fucking statements, by your own words. Which is very damning. Over and over. Over and over again. I thought we would never be more than friends. Here we go, here's your My name's Fred and I like dildos up my ass. Here's a War 5 campaign map. Right, and here's your collectibles. Oh my god. Oh my god. Again, I don't like games like this. Open world games. Which I've stated in previous videos. But I can't have an opinion on that either. Because everything has to be amazing when you're fanboying out over a game. You can't just have an opinion that's like, no, no, I don't like that shit. Oh, we actually learned a little more about how that shit works. Actually. It, it sucks. <laughs> and it's not Assassin's what you Creed. thought it was. And hey, collectibles yes, in Halo it is. are cool it's like too. ES5. They're not bad. People like collectibles in Halo. No, they don't. Why, why, Fuck why off. Why is it ew? No one liked like, this shit. What? I was right. You were wrong. That's even worse. You're going to get so many... What's this now? Let's do, let's try and work. Hi. Would you like to sign my petition? Get these out before we fucking... This guy is well, a loon. Skulls. So this is only going to be one map. This isn't going to be the whole game. All right? So in this particular zone, you have two skulls to... Yeah, in the IGN uh, video I saw, it was pretty big. Like this little area alone, this one section of it, was pretty freaking big. This is my point. I don't like open world games. Enough said. Um, it, yeah, there's a lot to do, and it's. I it's don't dead. want a lot to do. I don't want to search for meaningless, pointless collectibles in Halo because that's what you do in Assassin's Creed or Horizon Zero Dawn. I don't want Halo to be those games. But you've never played Halo, don't like Halo gameplay, so you love this shit, apparently. Even though you hate Sony, when like 95% of Sony games are like this. But if I don't like that, I'm a Sony pony. Makes total sense. Everything what you're saying, it really makes a lot of sense there, doesn't it? It's, it's not open spacious emptiness, it's dense. It's literally what you just said. Very well placed enemy locations and no. items, and I'm so glad that they took their time to design, design it all out. <laughs> really well. That I can tell you for a fact. Is that going to be audio logs, maybe, or is that audio logs? Right. There are audio logs. Yes. So they, they were both audio PC logs, news flash. But there's also like I was watching the gameplay today. I hate and, audio like, logs. The people that you save don't just like do nothing they legit fight off enemies who try fighting oh back my at fucking god this like, guy is so full of shit enemy man. versus like the enemy versus so your, full uh, of fucking garbage your backup is pretty fucking cool like yeah. seeing them come back so cool you haven't played it in three not months very clear on what they are that that's gonna yeah be i like went full postal points or something what's this small small ovens from small houses This is the most British fucking thing ever. <laughs> this is the most fucking British thing ever. From these like ODST dog tags or something? Yeah, I'm from Britain. That tends to happen. I'm an English person, so I tend to speak English. It's you guys that can't fucking speak English. You fucking Griffin Gaming cult retards. I mean... Okay. That's a lot of fucking. I love how much he assumed. So now we're just we're playing Assassin's Creed Halo. We're playing. I love it because facts spoken again. A true revolutionary calls out the entire basis of how the open world is going to work. It's going to be like Assassin's Creed Halo. There you go. Correct. One hundred percent. Before even playing it, just to fucking looking at a map screen. Like, the people who played the fucking game and got their hands on it said, 
Oh, were... the, the shills that were paid to play it said it was fucking amazing. Yeah, yeah. We believe them, don't we? Yeah. Worried it would be like an Assassin's Creed Halo, but no. It's and, a... and of course they said it wasn't because they were paid to do so. You retard. Akin to some, its own thing. And I'm like, ah. Oh. What do they give the game? A 10 out of 10? Where you have to spend $60 for the campaign? The campaign only? Is that really a 10 out of 10 game? I don't think so. I don't think that's a fucking 3 out of 10 game. That fucking sucks. Dick. Ooh, thank God they didn't just give Master Chief fetch quests and Master Chief... That's code. literally what you have in the game. Literally. Collect these items for me and bring them over here. It's like... That's literally what you do in the game. No, you're Master Chief. People serve you. You don't serve people. They... What are you talking about? Serve you. People are like, yeah, Master Chief, we're there to back you up. It's tight. Yeah, after he goes Ubisoft over there Halo. to do the job for him. Um, Far Cry Halo. We're playing Gears 5. You know, it's, Gears 5. It's one of these games, man. This guy never played Gears 5 because I didn't know exactly what I was talking about. With the overworld map and you go around collecting shit with the special weapons. That's exactly what this game is like. It's a valid comparison, yet this guy's like, blah, 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 because he never played Gears 5. This is the problem. He doesn't play video games, and the ones he does play, he doesn't even play those very much. One of games, these man. cookie cutter, cookie run of the mill, ten a penny games. Games. Same shit. Go like, here. If you haven't got an argument, just like make silly voices. Games, 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 games. Collect this. Wrong. Destroy this AA Wrong. gun. Well, no, I was right, and we've got proof because the game came out now, so we've got proof of this, that it is exactly what I'm saying. Well, he is. we got to see Do more this. today. No. Amazing. With no co-op. Yeah, the no co-op does suck. Oh, it does. does it really? Because I thought no split-screen co-op uh, was fine at the beginning of the video, but again, it's not fine now. Look at your fucking mind. But it'll be there later, so I'm alright with it. Oh, it'll be there later. Yeah, it won't. It'll be cancelled. Split screen corpse cancelled. Yeah. And it'll be there next year, 2023. That's two fucking years. Well, a year. Yeah, two fucking years before the fucking co op's released. Is that a good turnover? Because I predicted that before. I was saying it was going to be like Gears 5, where everything was fucking super fucking delayed. I was saying it was going to be worse than Halo 5's content delivery. Okay, I was saying that before launch, again. So I was right. You're not listening. Because it's delayed, and it's not even guaranteed to come in in three months when they said it's coming. It's like, oh, it can be... Oh, really? Who would have guessed? I can actually kind of see why it was hard for them to make this, like... Death. Yeah, but where's, what about the point that I just made, that it's not coming in three months? That that's bullshit. Co-op there at launch, like... Yeah, like how are you gonna skip the point out with two players? It was a correct it's point. Fucking hard. Again, like, I, I was I right. Where's the apology? How they're gonna make it work? Co-op. Like you're gonna have to balance the game out differently. The same way they have in other fucking games that actually are fucking good. Not this piece of shit. But we'll see. Be delayed again. No fucking weather effects. No fucking what? No weather effects. Still valid points again. Uh, okay. What do you mean, okay? There's no day to night transitions in an open world game. There's no fucking weather. It doesn't change weather. It's always the same fucking weather. Halo CE, you said the game was like, where you have snow at times, where you have rain, where you have fucking night time. All that was in Halo 1 in 2001. This game doesn't have any weather. It's all the fucking same. It was supposed to have day to night transitions, weather effects. All this was supposed to be in the game, yet it's all still not in the fucking game because the game wasn't finished. The game should have been delayed. These are all valid points that still hold up today. You were wrong again. Oh, God. Oh, God. He's right. No ray tracing? Come in. Come on. No ray tracing at launch. There we go. Jesus, fucking what was up with that fucking pause? Dynamic weather at launch, man. Like, 
Oh, oh, dynamic weather at launch. Okay. Yeah, I don't think that's in there. No. Of course it's not fucking there, because the game's not ready, and it's still not fucking ready now. That's why you're pissing and moaning about it now. Why don't you fucking say it before launch, you fucking turnip? The game is not ready yet. They're releasing it. Uh. Yes. No. No, really? It looks pretty ready for release now. Oh, does it? <laughs> it looks ready, does it? Oh, it looks ready, guys. Oh, I'm so I don't know. I'm a bungee fan. I don't know what I'm talking about. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The game's totally fucking ready to release, guys. Yeah, that's fucking aged well, hasn't it? I thought it wouldn't when I heard all the news, but I finally saw the, the actual gameplay and shit. I'm like, yeah, that, that looks pretty ready. Moron. It was fucking shot free to play. On the banished, any way they choose. What was that? Banished Silos. Let's go back and look at that. Banished. Fun. What did I, was there anywhere close to what these things are? Network. The Destroy the silos. You see? Generic fucking missions. Go and destroy an AA gun. Yeah, but, I mean... But, yeah, I'm right. Suck a dick. Die in a ditch. You were wrong. You're supposed to get rid of the fucking... What, do you, what else are you supposed to... No, you're not, because you're not supposed to make Halo an open-world game like Assassin's Creed. Because it's not meant to be like that. Joe Staten even fucking said that. Why are we doing this shit? Master Chief shouldn't have to eat fucking boar to fucking heal his health. That was on the fucking table at one point. Okay, we know this shit now. So, my points are completely and utterly valid here. And you've got literally no argument whatsoever. Your argument is, all games have to be the fucking same like Assassin's Creed. And if you don't like that, you can fucking fuck off because you're a Bungie fanboy. What a retarded notion. It's like... I can have an opinion that the game sucks on that basis because I don't enjoy those kinds of games. What's so hard to understand about that? Even if you fucking enjoy it, why does everybody else have to enjoy the same shit you do? When we know you're not fucking right in the head anyway. Supposed to do to the banished? <laughs> Is that fucking retarded argument like, oh, we're supposed to fight the banished? What, what, what? Why does the gameplay structure have to be in that particular fashion, like an Assassin's Creed game? Go. Answer the actual question. The actual points is what I'm trying to say. That wasn't the point. Of course, we've got to fight the banished. They're the en only enemy in the game for the first time in a Halo game ever. There's only one enemy type. But, you know, the game wasn't fucking... Uh, not ready. Amazing. <laughs> Are you supposed to just leave their base there? <laughs> We're not supposed to have Assassin's Creed missions in Halo. That's the point you think you're not understanding here. And if you had a brain, you would understand the point. But the means you don't, and we can see that you don't, we're going to move on. What? <laughs> $2 from Grimpy. You excited for new Fable? Uh, we'll see. We'll see. It's been a while since I played Fable. I was actually... Let me guess, you're going to defend the new Fable before it comes out, and then after it comes out, you're going to say it fucking sucks. But you're not going to admit you were wrong in previously about it being amazing, right? Let me see. Did that go out? It's going to go down? Because that's how it goes down with you every time. actually playing it on the uh, Game Pass streaming shit, and it was, it was, I was just remembering how cool it was. It was, it was one of Xbox's more interesting games uh, during that generation like you were not old enough to play fable when it came out don't lie that's bullshit they, they tried something they tried something cool they really did stop lying but we'll have to wait and see what happens if stop this guy's lying. trying to make me go to sleep just by talking he's accomplishing it yeah me too yeah is that why everything i've said's come true so far i haven't been wrong once in however long it's been the clouds are dynamic because there is some form of weather. There is no weather in the game. Moving on. No weather. The sun has exploded. Oh, for real? Oh, okay. These guys are trolling him now and he's taking it as real. What? Really? There's no artificial weathering in, for the halos? I'm trying to remember the fucking lore. It's been a while. I thought there was the artificial... Guys are trolling him in his own chat now. Artificial weather on these things. Come on, huh. man. Get to the video. Anyway, I'm dreading editing this here, one. Do this. Destroy the silos. Zero of two. 
Fuck, I need to re-catch up on my Halo lore. I used to have the Halo Combat Evolved book. You think? Na now you, you say this? You don't have a fucking clue about anything that I've been saying so far. But now you need to brush up on your Halo lore. Amazing. Uh, yeah. It was like, it explained a lot more about the Halo than the game itself. It was pretty cool, but it's been a long time. That's Halo now. A generic run of the mill. A game you've played one of, you've played them all. Game. Not legendary Halo 1 campaign where every single fucking thing in the game is fucking amazing. Every fucking level is different. This is the closest Halo's been to Combat Evolved since Combat Evolved. That's the biggest load of bullshit in the history of statements ever. I'm not even going to qualify that with a response. We already went over it before, but it just shows the idiocy of these people. And now they're doing this shit. What? <laughs> it's like, it's recapturing the Halo magic. That's what it's yeah, doing. it really recaptured the Halo magic, didn't it? Yeah. Yeah, of course it did. This is just... Do, 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 do. There will be weather, fog, snow, etc. Are you sure? Um... N not yet uh, there is natural according nearly to Halo two years CD after Katana. launch oh okay nothing so, yeah, with no sun then there would be no yeah that makes sense it, it's it's halo mass effect andromeda it's dragon age inquisition it's we've all played these games we've played millions of them this is not exciting at all there's nothing here to be excited about there Correct. is weather in halo infinite there isn't, you uh, dickheads! I haven't seen, like, full-on, like, weather, like, full-on pouring rain. It's delayed, like, like everything that, fucking yeah, I else. Seen, I haven't Still. Seen, I haven't actually seen, like, you know, things like that yet. But I think... I you won't do, because it's delayed! I'm like, okay, clearly, like, those are forming over some... I don't know, there's clearly, like, clearly the wet areas... Fucking Jesus. ...weather, right? Like, there's gotta be rain. There isn't rain because it's, it's delayed. Halo I just told you in the video. Open your ears. With, like, some unclear answers, like, the game's not finished. Kind of like, uh, and it still isn't, isn't finished. You're a retard. Like, well, sort of, it's a kind of, yeah. I'm like, well, I'm going to just play it and see if it is what it is. Like, Yeah. Da, 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 da. Every CE level is different. No. Well, yeah, they well, are. It's trying to recapture Halo's combat magic. Yeah, there's a snow map. There's a map in space. Yeah? Where's that in Halo Infinite? There's none of that shit. You're talking bollocks. Like from Combat Evolved. There is weather in Halo Infinite. Uh, there is over a dozen ratchet. There's a bunch of people in this chat trying to convince him that there's weather in Halo Infinite. Even though I know for a fact and I've already stated in the video that it's fucking delayed. What part of delay do they not understand? What? Well, look it up. Seriously. Action and clank games, yet ponies keep laughing. It. Well, I'm not going to treat this guy like a pony because he's not a pony. So I'm not going to talk to him like a pony. He's just a fucking bungee boomer for Halo. And it's. Yeah, bungee boomer. Yeah, 10 year plan. Halo didn't have a three month plan. Yeah. 343 has done more damage. Oh, you're, you're a bungee boomer, Fritz. Oh, Fritanga's a bungee boomer. Wow, how sad. It's, uh, it's, it's, it's quite appalling. A little more disgusting than even being a pony. When you're right, you're wrong. fucking right. Wrong. When you're wrong, so many ways. and you're on drugs, Bungie you're wrong. Fan. My God. Storms and snowstorms are there. Okay. No, there isn't. It's delayed um, for the millionth time. Move game. on. Nothing here to be excited about. Huh? Does this make compare here? You Let's fucking go. lemon. I got. A, I, I really got to know. Five dollars from Crimp, Crimpy. Fable is the goat of open world. <clears throat> That's not open world. I'm too hyped for new Pay this drug guy $5 yeah. so he can fucking buy more drugs. It's going to be interesting. Get, I don't get know, him I off the internet and finish him Good off. For them. About time. Okay, what is there to be excited about here? Really? 130k likes. New right? story, new enemies. New Surely weapons. if nearly two... There is no story. No, there isn't new enemies. They're exactly the same as they were in previous fucking games. So I don't know where the new enemies is coming from. What new enemies? It's just the brutes. They're not new enemies. If anything, they're worse than they were previously because there's no fucking weapons. So why is it new enemies? It's all bullshit. Nothing what you're saying holds water at all.
It's all bollocks. A million people freaking watch the video. It should have more than 130k likes. Some people just didn't care. They watched it and moved on with their lives. Clearly, because this shit is just so fucking dull. We're this gonna see just, it live. This is about as generic. Yeah, as we're gonna talk. see, and the hype train is gonna go down, like I said, and then you'll be saying this shit. Funny, isn't it? I always right on all counts, right? We're gonna see it launch. Yeah, we're gonna see it launch, and yeah, it's gonna fail. Yeah. Copy and paste as it could possibly be. This is lame, even for a free for free game. He hasn't even fucking played it yet. I don't need to, you moron. I was right on all counts. That means I don't even need to play it. I know what it's going to be like. That's how fucking smart I am. You're an idiot. It's not difficult. If you've played any of these types of games, like the ones I listed, Mass Effect Andromeda and all that, you've seen this fucking map screen before. You've played this game before. They're all the fucking same. It's not difficult. He hasn't even fucking played it yet. I don't need to! I mean, we've played Halo 4 and we've played Halo 5. This is lame on a whole other fucking level to those games. This makes those games look good. I mean that sincerely. I'm not just saying this for clicks and views. Yeah, I'm you not are. trying to hate on the game. For I'm, the I'm saying it for clicks and views when he's already pointed out I got more dislikes and likes. This is for clicks and views. Amazing. What, this guy making a fucking five-hour fucking live stream fucking smoking pot is is not uh, taking donations what's that for and he was wrong on all counts and still hasn't apologized this is incredible I'm hating on it yeah, you are. i'm literally telling you the facts okay because the facts Gears yeah War 5. how are you telling us facts if you haven't fucking played it yet <laughs> because i'm right and this is so the are facts War 5 with a halo skin on it with regard to the map and the fucking exploration right that's yeah, because we can see it right there on the from. fucking screen, GLL, right. yeah. And Gears of War fucking got it from... All How hard is that? Upset. We've all played these fucking games, the ten a penny. It, go here, go there, click on the map, go here. Yeah, but some of them are actually good. But, but it's not Halo, you moron! That's the point! I don't want it in Halo and neither does anybody else. Neither do you. You're just a fucking moron defending it for the sake of it. It's retarded. It really is retarded. Just because we've seen them before doesn't mean they're all bad. Just because we've... But it's not a Halo game. I don't play Halo to play fucking Mass Effect Andromeda. So what's the fucking point in arguing with you when I'm just making a point that I don't want in Halo? That I'm not excited for something I've played a billion times before? How hard is that to understand? Really? Come on. Seeing something before doesn't mean it's bad by fucking default. You're not going to fucking suddenly like it in Halo. If you hated it and everything else, what is your fucking point, man? This is retarded. Look at Doom. Doom was what it used to be, but when they brought it back, it fucking rose. It went back. Stop to talking about Doom. Again. We're talking about Halo. Something wrong with going back. Move on with your life. Place. There's no <laughs> map like this in Doom. Whatever. They go there. Uh, that's not Halo. That's not. It's just not Halo, man. So Correct. Who? You? That was, but that was late. Oh, yeah, yeah. I remember the Assassin's Creed maps and all the other fucking Halo games. So I was it fucking Halo, genius. Can get. Uh, it could be, like, let's take a good one of those type of games, like Ghost Recon Wildlands. Okay, I had a blast playing Ghost Recon. I'm going to barf. Then barf. Get off the drugs. Ugh. This is retarded. Ghost Recon Wildlands. You know what the irony is? Is that Ghost Recon Wildlands has a better open world than Halo Infinite. You do realize that. And now this guy is throwing up, supposedly, because he doesn't like Ghost Recon Wildlands. A game that is superior to Halo Infinite. You know what it launched with? Four player co op at launch. How, how hard is that to understand? Really? Ghost Recon Wildlands is a terrible game, but it has four-player co-op at launch and has the exact same fucking map structure as this game where you click on something, it highlights an objective, you go over there in your helicopter or your vehicle, 
you do the objective and then you move on to the next one and it has missions built into the map just like halo infinite where you go to your fucking mission and then you complete it and then you can't fucking replay it until you complete the fucking whole lot of missions or whatever right it has the exact same mission structure the exact same fucking designs this game was heavily inspired by games like ghost recon wildlands and yet it didn't have four player co-op at launch like ghost recon wildlands did Ghost Recon Wildland had campaign DLC that I suspect is coming for this game. This is a very good comparison to make. Ghost Recon Wildlands did it better than Halo Infinite in terms of the four-player co-op and in terms of an open-world perspective, right? But that's not what I'm asking for in Halo. I'm not asking for a Ghost Recon Wildlands Halo. I'm asking for Halo to be like Halo. And, and I'm saying there, that's like one of the only ones that I enjoyed. Particularly because it was fucking co-op. And the co-op's not even in this game yet. And he's throwing up over that. When I'm, I'm literally got fucking concrete facts that it's a better game. But that game sucks. And this is what I'm talking about. If, if you think Ghost Recon Wildlands sucks and you're entitled to your opinion. And you think all that fucking shit sucks where you like go around and do objectives and stuff. That's what Halo Infinite is. So what is he talking about? So why act like a fucking five-year-old? Use your brain. For real? You fall with that? That's more monotonous than even like a fucking standard Assassin's Creed. This is the point I'm making about this game. This is the gameplay. God, are British people this stale by default? Are you this wow. retarded? It's, it's a brilliant comparison between two fucking games that have a similar fucking open world fucking campaign. But apparently, Ghost Recon Wildlands sucks. But this game's going to be fucking awesome, even though it's using the exact same fucking type of exploration model. With a map and objectives. The same as every fucking open world game has done since like 2000 or whatever. It's literally the same game over and over and over again. That's what I'm saying. We played thousands of them. So why is this so special? And yet I compare it to one that came out fairly recently and oh shit, that game was terrible. Well, there you go. That's your own fucking argument destroyed right there that this is going to be a good game. And we know it wasn't a good game. And now you're pissing and moaning that it's a terrible game. Oh, it's from Crimpy. It's not about exclusively. It, it's about how it's played and Gears of the Goat. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mm hmm. For real. He legit just said, I had a, I had a lot of fun with Wildlands. Wait, shut the fuck up. <laughs> just shut the fuck up. So, is that like a hot take now? You can't like Ghost Recon Wildlands? Because if you do, apparently, you can't have an opinion on anything ever again. But this guy can have an opinion about a game that hasn't come out yet and say it's amazing. I played Ghost Recon Wildlands. I can't have an opinion on that either, apparently. Apparently, that's a bad fucking take. Oh, Wildlands sucks, even though it launched with its fucking content. Launched with four-player fucking co-op. This game didn't even offer us that. It didn't even offer us a, a decent fucking campaign with four-player co-op out of the box. guy's insane he's actually insane it's got to be the drugs stop talking stop fucking talking no you stop talking move <laughs> on this video is dragging on man move on Wildlands. with my cousin we fucking did the whole fucking game right okay yeah but this is not ghost recon wildlands for starters the co-op is fucking delayed and this ain't going to be anywhere near... So why are you comparing it? Like, why are you bring it up? It's not the same... Why it's not going to be anywhere near as good. Finish the point, idiot. Bring it up. Near the level of Ghost Recon fucking Wildlands. And the game came out, and it wasn't. GLL was right yet again. What a surprise. That's just the fact right now. Right here, I'm telling you right now. Ugh. 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 
Oh, can you believe you can mark stuff that you can go target? Can you believe you can ping? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what a fucking. Oh, God. This guy's. Uh, he's too British for me. Oof. You're Ten too, from crappy posts. You're too much of a droggy for me, I've man. You love in 42K. I've been playing Get off the drugs. For blood on Game Pass, and holy shit. I wish my PC wasn't literally dying so I could just play Left 4 Dead 2, which is 10 times better. Oh. That's another terrible take. Back for Blood's fucking amazing. Ba Back for Blood, I have not played it. I have not played it, sir. Shut it down. Permanently. So you got like firefight area. I mean, it's cool to see that vehicle again. The Scor I think it was a scorpion. It's cool to see it again. Fucking scorpion! It's a fucking brute chopper! Oh my god. Here's your big Halo fan here. Can't tell a fucking scorpion tank from a brute chopper. Moving on. In the game. Oh, what was it called? What was it called? I fucking it's a brute it. chopper, you retard! Play Halo! Learn the game! Moron! Oh, remember when Dr. Disrespect was cringe there? Fucking hooking again. Everything in this game is about that fucking grappling hook. Will he get a fucking life? Uh, Seriously. Uh, Come on. Uh, uh, Upgrade. Uh, Someone's <laughs> mentioned this to me, yeah. So you can like, level uh, your guys and stuff. And level uh, Oh, the chopper. It was called the chopper? Okay. Wow, really, was it? I, I mean, I mean, a Halo movie. fan would know that, right? Oh my god, I need to re-catch up. I'm gonna replay the Halo trilogy before- You never played him in the first place, you lying cunt. Catch up on shit again. The you chopper. lying cunt. It looks good in this game, yeah. It really does. I, I love does it? it? Really? Um, but the scorpion looks good, does it? it the big, scorpion? Uh, what, it, uh, what mode was it? The biggest- What the scorpion uh, does? Uh, the Scorpion Chopper, the yeah. map that I love using that shit on. This is a Halo 3 map. Oh my god. Halo 3. You don't remember the map, neither. <laughs> I'm so uh, no, it's called Grappling. It looks awesome. Yeah. Grapple Epic. Yeah, this guy's complaining about fucking Yeah, the grapple's grappling epic. Mode. That's why you all Whoa, left the game and haven't played it for three months. Get, get, a, get a life. life. You've not played it. That's, that's, that's your criticism of the grapple hook? They keep showing the grappling hook. That's the only thing they had. And no one is going to care about that after five minutes. The hype is going to die off. And it did. And the game fucking died. Case in point. These guys live in a fantasy world. That is your criticism of the grappling hook. That they Go. keep shoving it down your throat over and over again because they've got nothing else to show. Yes, it's my criticism of the grappling hook. I don't want it. I don't care about it. And neither is anybody else going to care about it in reality. It's not going to make the game sell more or less because there's a grappling hook in it. It's not going to make any difference whatsoever. Go oh, get, get a life. life. Yes, get a life. Brilliant. You were wrong. Oh, I guess Again. British people aren't smart by default. I guess we were wrong about that, guys. No, you were right. You were right all along, because everything I've said has come true. Five dollars from Crimpy. Go brutal on them, senpai. Sand trap, yes. Scorpion is the tank. Fuck. I'm really, the scorpion is the tank. You know, even your own fucking loser fan base can fucking point that out to you. How stoned do you have to be? Things wrong tonight. You're an idiot. That's the problem. Like it's not tonight. It's every night. It's every day. <laughs> we see it now. It's every fucking day, man. Yeah, Sand Trap. Sand Trap is fucking amazing for con um for like conquest and. I don't oh know why he's saying that because he didn't play Halo back in the day. I can tell you that right now. Anything he's played has been on MCC. He hasn't played shit to do with Halo. I'm telling you now. <laughs> it's such a it's such a cancerous map. If you if you your team can what? control all the vehicles, that map is pure cancer. I, I would never say anything like that about a Halo map. That just shows how fucking retarded this guy is. Fucking love it. 
Because with Alex, we, we got a bunch of people on... Um, or this like, is MCC, you see? This is MCC. This isn't the game. You didn't play Halo 3 back in the day. Playing one Friday night. And we yes. got full-on vehicle control, and the other team was pissed. On MCC. <laughs> fucking great. Not Halo 3. Thank you. Oh, I love that map. Also, I used to play it on the 360 with my No, friends. you didn't. We used to turn it on to near zero gravity and we'd be like taking massive jumps and sniping each other in the air like no that's a video you watched of somebody else that wasn't you because you've got 3000 gamer score so that would be impossible because if you played all the other all the halo games on the 360 you think you would have at least 2000 200 sorry 200 gamer score on each of them so how you got 3000 gamer score on your entire account for the xbox that makes no sense what you're saying makes no sense in reality good times to be had Good times to be had. Five dollars from D three four D five one G H T three D. British people. I bet this guy could sit on a popsicle and tell me what flavor it is. Oof. 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 See, uh, no British person is surely that retarded, unless your name's Miss Chief, because he likes dildos up his ass. So that's one for him, not me. Yeah, Sand Trap is such a fucking. It's it's the fun kind of cancer map. The fun kind of cancer map. These children, man. Yeah, Doc really doesn't sound so bad after hearing this guy. Doctor Disrespect wasn't right about the game. I was right about the game on every count. Gravity, I'm over no gravity. Yeah. The crap we look again! Every fucking thing, I swear down. Every fucking thing in this game is just about that fucking grappling hook. It's it's almost as if um It's almost as if the game fucking sucks and they've got nothing else to show, like I've been saying since the beginning of this fucking video. It's a vital new tool that Whatever. That's not the point, is it? They've got nothing else to show. Can help you. I mean We don't care. Real Halo fans don't care. You don't have to use it. It's not well, if it's a vital tool, then you've just gone back on what you just said. Not necessary to use. That's not what you just said. You said a vital tool. Like vital means you have to use it. You can not use it, but well, no, it's vital. You just said it two seconds ago. If you use it, it's way fun. A lot more fun. It's way more cool. So it's vital, then you have to use it. So you're forced to play the game in a manner you do not wish to play, because that's the most efficient way of playing it. Got it. So the game sucks then. Cause it's not a Halo game. Cool. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. sorry. Like, uh, <laughs> like King Thrash says, more funner. Wow, wow, look at that. I don't know why you're going on about King Thrash because he owns your ass as well because he played more Forza than you did. And you're you were defending Forza, and he was saying it was shit, and he played more of it than you did because you don't play video games. He exposed your gamer card. They say you don't play fucking Xbox, which you don't. You got 3,000 gamer score. So what are you talking about? That thing's vol volcanoing like a mother... Look at that. That thing doc... The, the doc yeah, the, the, the thousands of fucking things you've got to blow up in the game because they couldn't think of anything else to put in. <laughs> fucking the chief blew up his volcanoing. Look at it. Wow, so Five exciting. from crappy posts. Halo 3 multiplayer, some dank haze and RGB lights going in the background is amazing. Also, I'm British and I disavow this British person. I don't care if you're British or if you disavow me because I was right and you dumbasses were wrong. Keep sucking fucking Futanga's dildo strap on. I don't care. He was wrong. He's always going to be wrong. He's always fucking wrong, even when he's right. Because all this shit contradicts what he's saying in this video. So even when he's right, he's wrong. Because it contradicts what he's already said. Oh, I mate. I believe you. See, British people aren't entirely bad. They gave us fucking... Never. The Rolling Stones, Pink Floyd. They gave us gorillas. They gave us... What did Pink Floyd teach you about? It was about not becoming part of the machine. There's a song called Another Brick in the Wall. So why are you an NPC if you listen to Pink Floyd? They literally gave that away in their song. Do not be another brick in the wall. That's like one of their most popular songs. You're just another brick in the wall. You're an NPC. That was the point of that song. And that is you 
down to a T. You react. You react to things. You don't analyze things critically. You don't look at something and say, right, well, that is bullshit. No, you believe everything the company tells you. That is being a brick in the wall, quote unquote. That's Pink Floyd. The Be Beatles, they gave us David Bowie. Fuck, they gave us a lot. All right, British people aren't that bad. Everything. Hook up there, hook this to you. Hook, hook up there. This, hook that, hook, hook this. Up. What the hell is he doing? Hook, hook that, hook. Everything. The whole fucking game is grappling up central. Going by these trailers. Every fucking second he's grappling up in something. It's cool. It's not cool. It's fucking idiot hype fucking bullshit. There's nothing cool about it. If anything, it ruined the game. What do you mean, fucking cool? For what reason? Fun! Try it! Fun, try it. The game wasn't even out. I couldn't try it if I wanted to. But I can see it's going to ruin the game because I'm not an idiot with hype goggles on. Or fucking drugs my eyes. Twenty more minutes of this guy. Okay, what is wrong with this picture, right? Yeah, that's right. The British also gave us Black Sabbath and Queen. Uh, fuck, I can name you all the British artists because I know a lot of them. <laughs> yeah. But you don't listen to the songs, do you? Because you are a brick in the wall. You don't think and analyze the songs and find out what the actual meaning behind them is. Because that's too fucking hard for you because you've got no fucking brain cells. Yeah, yeah, yeah. British people gave us the best. Honestly, without a doubt, British people gave us the best music. Okay. This is Halo. Right? Halo. British humor is also better than American humor. Yeah, the British office is on a whole other level than the American office. Like, well, both of those fucking series suck. The American office and the fucking British office. They're not even funny to begin with. Oh my god. Go... You, it's hard to sit through an entire episode of the British office. It's like, oh my God, this is cringe. Ah, it's so good. It's so fucking good. Yeah. 20. Nor That's a show for fucking 12 year olds again. Norwegian, Norwegian Croins from Psyker Gaming. This guy kind of sus to be honest. Yeah, I know. Right. So what do you do in Halo, especially on hard difficulties, but what are you meant to do? It, it's like, there's supposed to be a dynamic with the weapons. There's supposed to be... So now I'm criticizing the weapons, something that has definitely been shown to be correct. Be a dynamic with the freaking weapon, right? So, yeah, okay, a hammer on normal should probably kill you. Yeah, like okay, now you've got this garbage grappling up. The we they're just showing you the various ways you can approach... No, they're... Shoving the grappling hook down your throat. Where's the various ways you can approach? If it's the various ways you can approach, why does he need to show the grappling hook? Again, for the 17th time in the video. What are you talking about, you balloon? What are you talking about? Combat in an enemy base. Is that not going what through your What a goofball. Right that, that they're just showing you the various ways you can approach these goofball. places. Goofball. Fight these enemies, complete the task. It's obvious, like, you don't like having different ways of doing something. Clearly... No, I'm just sick of the same bo boring shit that they're not showing us anything else. Where's the other weapons? And then, lo and behold, the game comes out, and there's a lack of weapon variety. Who would have known that? Um, me, again, was right. Again, thank you. Clearly, you're, you're such a fan of the quick time boss battle with Locke. That's your shit. There was no quick time boss battle with Locke. It was a cutscene. You're thinking of Halo 4. Again, you didn't play Halo 5. There is no quick time events in Halo 5. So proving again, you didn't play Halo 5. What a balloon. What a fucking goof. $5 from Crimpy. I would like to see more videos with you and Alex. Y'all can co-op and get money. Yes, sir. Eat grenades. Alex is in mischief. What was that grenade for? Oh, it hit a fucking barrel, right? Because it was an actual grenade. So, look, look, right? What? Grenades are always terrible in three, four, three games. So you ain't gonna use What? No. Yes, they are. That's a fact. They're always weaker than their fucking bungee counterparts. That's a fact. So what's this? No! I can literally prove that through gameplay. 
they are weaker. So what are you going to say now? No, they're not. Why? You didn't play Halo 5 or Halo 4. We've just gone over this. So how do you know the difference? You didn't play them. You're basing shit on MCC, which isn't even the real games. You didn't play the real games. You've never played the real fucking games, man. Stop lying to yourself and stop lying to everybody else. Oh. No, 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 no. I yes. I fucking love their names. Shut up. No. Shut up. Don't care what you say because you don't play the games. You never played that fucking Halo game at this point. Like, seriously, you've not played Halo 5 or Halo 4. Unless you played them through MCC, which isn't the original games anyway. So what is he talking about? Right, so look at this here, right? One, two, three, four, five, blah, 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 blah. That's Halo 5 game. There right it is. There. That's what you guys are talking that's about. That's how you play Halo 5. You pull out your BR or your fucking... And that's a fact too. Where all you do in Halo 5 is use your BR and DMR and shoot things down. You don't have any strategy. You don't plasma pistol anything. Alright? That's what this game is like to an extent. Yes. DMR and you shoot things. Huh? Even on harder difficulties. He's not going to understand it because he doesn't understand Halo gameplay. I'm talking about plasma pistols, sticky grenades. I'm talking about using the environment. What is he talking about? He's just sitting like, what? 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 You mean you shoot things with the guns? Yes, you shoot things with the guns, but you use other weapons. You combine things. You don't do that in Halo 5. That's the point. Jesus Christ, man. It helps to have played Halo 5 to understand what I'm saying. But he didn't play Halo 5, even though he claims to have done. Because he did the QTE sequence, the quick time event, in Halo 5 against Locke. Even though that doesn't exist. Because he made it up. Because he hasn't played the game. He just assumes that it's in the game. Because he hasn't played it. <sighs> right? right? Where was the plasma rifle? Where was the plasma pistol? Where plasma was... rifle. Plasma rifle is not in the game. Any attempt to take down this guy's shields. Now I know in Halo 2 the battle rifle. Uh, Again, there is no attempt to take down the guy's shields. He just shoots him with a battle rifle. Uh. <laughs> there's nothing in the trailer showing that shit there is no noob combo or whatever in the fucking trailer it doesn't exist it's not in the trailer so bad it's why is it bad i'm telling you a fact so goddamn bad this is a bad video this is a really, really... Uh, well, when it all comes true in the game, it's not a bad video, is it? When you're fucking pissing and moaning about it, it comes true, then what? Then you've got to apologize, haven't you? Then you egg on your face. Really fucking bad, bad video. Is uh... it? Is it really? <laughs> what is wrong with this guy? Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, creepy. Just call me creepy. Okay, <laughs> Hey, what a weirdo. we're not friends. You insulted Joshy. This is the... Th this guy's on a whole other level of fucking weird because he's on drugs and he just... He thinks he's funny, but he's not. He's like... He tries to make silly voices like... Oh! Huh? It's like... He's so fucking cringe. You bro broke my arm. Don't call me. Don't talk to me. We're not I didn't know what he's anymore. doing. We're done. <laughs> you know what, Greg Heffley? You're not a good friend. <laughs> Two dollars from. I'm not saying your name. It's. Uh, Oi, bruv. You have, <laughs> you have, or, you have your rappelin' hook, loisins. <laughs> Oi, bruv. You have your. <laughs> Oi, bruv. You have your rappelin' hook, loisins. Don't oh do God. drugs, kids. Don't do fucking drugs. He's not an Aussie. To anybody but young watching my videos, stay off the drugs. Don't end up like this guy, like guy, please. People say Northern British. Don't end up like this guy. Very deep, very like. I basically skip letters. Guy's gonna to be fucking words. on the street Accent. corner begging for money for drugs. <laughs> I just skip certain letters. That's don't what's really gonna finish happen. A word and I sound British. Like a deaf cannon too. But you still normally see, like we say, but but he says but. See, he, he completely like skips words. Use the fucking like overcharge letters. On the what drugs. is he talking about? Some people on even on normal, right? We we say but but he says but. Yeah. Like really. 
Like, come on. Like, just because everything is so watered down, huh? basic. Like, huh? literally everything is watered down in this game. I can't believe how accurate this video is. The game is... How would I... How would I even know the game was watered down from this trailer? I, I, I forgot I even said that. The game is seriously watered down. That... I'm, I'm a visionary, man. That is insane that I even said that. And yet, he's like, Huh? And we all know the outcome. <laughs> it's huh? like, pull out, out a gun and shoot somebody. Uh, There's no like, oh, well... Uh, he's got fucking shielding, so if you try and kill him with that gun without a fucking plasma pistol, it's going to take you way fucking longer or whatever. There's none of that. And the enemies don't huh? even react. They just stand there like... Huh? Like, if you're going to show us the campaign, show us some fucking legendary gameplay. Show us something. <sighs> this guy is slow, man. This is so much up there. That's Everything I've said came true. The, the AI is poor. There you go. I, I was right. Two dollars from Wimpy. Did I do something wrong? No, no. I was just um, I was quoting Diary of a Wimpy Kid. That scene where Crowley basically breaks so up with it, uh, it, it, Diary of a Wimpy Kid. He's he's trolling his own fans, and his own fans don't even know what's going on because he's on drugs. He doesn't have a fucking clue what he's doing. And it's fucking hilarious. Like it's such a good scene. You've disrespected Joshy. Nobody cares about Diary of a Wimpy Kid. We're talking though. about Halo. This is the most generic shit ever. It's literally walk around and and fucking shoot things. Fucking. Halo 5 gameplay. This is not Halo 5 gameplay. Stop. Yes, it is, you moron. They don't have to qualify that. That's just a fact. Stop. Stop capping this hard. Like, I know you did Stop it. saying the truth. Don't say the truth, man. Don't say the truth that it's Halo 5 gameplay. We're not supposed to say that, even though it has the same shit in from Halo 5. Can't say that. For the attention, con congratulations, but my God. Being British has made this worse. This video worse by default. So, so you can't say the truth? You can't just say that it's Halo 5 gameplay, even though it is Halo 5 gameplay? And that was a fact even back then? Let, let, let alone now. Two from Crappy Pose. This FPS is bad because I shoot things. Disgusting. I know. Like, yeah, because there's nothing else to it. The shooting sucks. There's no dynamic. You don't have a various weapon variety. There's no plasma rifle in the game. There's no plasma rifle in the trailer. Use your fucking eyes, goofballs. Seriously, what, what, Luke? I'm not making this stuff Luke. up. Look what they... Woohoo! Cool. Okay, look. One, two. Okay, kill them. All right, look up at the things for a dramatic effect. Uh, one, two, three. Uh, 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 uh. They're fucking headshots! Halo isn't about headshotting elites. Try that shit on Halo 2, man. I'm serious. That look... That's not proper Halo gameplay, man. Seriously, you gotta use the plasma pistols and the fucking r plasma rifles and shit to wear down the shields. What Halo games have you been playing? Yeah, I'm sure you can take out one fucking elite with a BR and Halo 2. Fine, okay. But that's the whole fucking trailer and they don't show anything else. And that's what Halo 5 was like. You just shot things with a fucking BR or DMR. It was boring. Good lord. They're goddamn headshots. Play Halo, then you'll understand. Play Halo, then you will understand. Wait, actually... Uh... No, never mind. For the multiplayer, I think the entire body takes as much damage as that. Oh my god, he doesn't even understand the mechanics! No, the entire fucking body doesn't take as much damage. It's three shots, then one shot to the head. For, so four shots total to kill somebody. If you shoot somebody in the belly, it's not four shots. Then it takes another fucking one or two, depending on how heavily you hit them. But on Halo 2, from a certain range, if you shoot them in the body, then it counts as a headshot because it had high magnetism. So it depends what fucking Halo game you're playing, doesn't it? Well, you wouldn't know any of that because you didn't play fucking Halo when it came out, ever. Head for multiplayer, is that the, what they did? I don't know about fucking the fucking retard. Headshot still. Yeah. Could be useful. If you like that kind of thing. Oh, I like it. 
It's tight. It's tight. That's why you haven't played it for three months. Who was right? Okay, that was not exciting whatsoever. You just fucking shot. That was literally not exciting whatsoever from somebody who's played every single Halo game ever. Yes, a scorpion tank came coming out of a garage and shooting one fucking enemy. Oh, so fucking exciting. There's nothing exciting about that. I'm telling the truth. Ship from the air? And you don't think that's sick? No, I don't because I've played all the fucking Halo games and you haven't. It's not sick. It's over. It's been done a thousand times and done better. Okay. Look at this shit. You can't do this. Game Master Chief and all. You, you're gonna tell me this is Halo 5 gameplay when you can't. Yeah, because only in Halo 5 would you be a complete psycho and jump out of a banshee in the fucking sky. Because in most Halo games, you're fucking dead. Halo 2, right there, you're fucking dead. Halo 3, you're fucking dead. So what fucking game are we playing here? Halo 1, you're dead. This wouldn't fucking happen in any other game but Halo 5. Do this shit in Halo, Halo 5? Well, the good game. Yes, you can do that shit in Halo 5. You just can't grappling hook. Whoop de fucking do. Look, it's the grappling hook again. That's all they're showing. Oh no. What do you mean, oh no? I'm right. Every time, I point out every time, all they keep showing is the grappling hook. Where's the shield? Where's all the other shit that was in the other fucking... Nothing. All they keep showing is the grappling hook because that's all they fucking had to show. They put that much effort into that grappling hook. They put it... Everything revolved around it. Hijacking vehicles. Fucking map tra transversal. Ev everything. Right? And they keep shoving it down your throat. I was sick of seeing it at this point. Just because you're sucking the dick of 343 at this point, I don't have to. It's the grappling hook again. Everything in this game is about that fucking grappling hook. It's a fucking- This is the same area from the fucking first trailer. Why can't he just admit everything in the game is about the fucking grappling hook when he himself has watched the same fucking trailer before this video and now watching it again and I'm saying, hey, it's this grappling hook every fucking time. And it is the grappling hook every time. But yeah, apparently that's not the case. Yes. Like the agile skimmers. A sadistic Spartan killer named Jega Urdamna. <laughs> I like that in the music. Jega Urdamna. <laughs> <laughs> right, so watch me now explain that this guy is fucking useless. He's, he's going to be a minor character, which he was in the game, by the way, so I'm going to be proved right. And then this guy's going to be like, Huh? Huh? He's Jul Andama's brother. <laughs> he's going to be killed in the fucking first cutscene of the game. <laughs> well, yeah, he's obviously going to get killed, but he's cool to look at him. Huh? The forerunner's lies are at an end. Hold on. Fred, you make me laugh. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you for making me laugh too. Hold on a minute. Why is the why is the queen from Gears in this now? Huh? Huh? Got the exact same voice as the queen in Gears of War, but huh? The leak spoiled a harbinger who looks like a character from fucking Destiny, by the way. Like a literal character from Destiny. Which again is true. It has the Queen from Gears of War's voice. Again, true. It doesn't get more Destiny than this right here. That is the most Destiny, Destiny thing you'll ever see. Destiny. Yeah, literally. That is literally a Destiny boss right there. And it was in the game too. It had a health bar and everything. It was a Destiny boss. Is, is that is that? Are you... They had Destiny bosses in this game all over the map, by the way. So I read into that and we predicted yet again something that was in the game, including this one, which was a Destiny boss. Destiny? Are you fucking for real right now? I was right. It is a Destiny boss, and it does have the Queen from Gears of War's voice. What do you mean? Are you kidding me right now? Huh? Huh? I was right again, you moron. Have you got any of these right so far? I haven't given you credit for anything. You've got nothing right. You literally have zero. You've got nothing. I'm, I'm, I've denied later you about 200 to 1 here. Everything I've said has come true about this game.
You've got nothing. You gotta be a troll. A troll? A troll. 20, I was right again. Norwegian coins from Psycho Gaming. Battlefield 2042 is also bad because windsurfing. 199 from Rakens. We need Imperial and True Monarchy Britain again. Yeah. Seeing Halo. They're literally like. These people are going off at the British like are completely retarded. None of them even know where fucking England is. If they came to invade it, they'd end up in Mexico. People are retarded. Be any more Destiny in here? Try. I'm guessing Joe Staten made that character. <laughs> um, like seriously, what the fuck is this? An enemy. A Destiny boss. Thank you. An enemy. Destiny you, you boss. Shoot it. It's part of the game. <laughs> Yeah, you shoot it and it has a health bar like a Destiny boss in the game. I was right. Woo! Pew! Yeah, that, that's you know? your level of intelligence, bro. That's literally your level of intelligence. That's why your brother stole your fucking girlfriend. It's part of that. That's what it is. <laughs> Five from Carlos Alarcon. Alarcon. Al Alarcon. Whatever. Uh... What are you talking about? Get off the drugs, you idiot! I've never heard of that last name. What is this guy on? Because I want some of it. Yeah. Uh, says talking. Who? I'm on something. Literally, the guy is on drugs, smoking a bong during the fucking stream. But I'm on something. Clever, smart, smart people. He um. Well, he's British. He's not on anything. They're boring by default. Yeah, we don't fucking get up to our eyeballs on fucking drugs and try and kill ourselves with substance abuse just to try and look fucking cool on YouTube, apparently. Like, what do you mean? Oh, it's boring not to fucking stick fucking syringes in your arm and inject heroin. That's so boring of me. Oh, dear. I wish I was exciting like Fratangi. What a fucking loser. And they spoil the fucking character. He's probably just on tea. That's it. All right, you're in the fucking trailer. Or whatever the fuck this is supposed to be, campaign over. I, I think it's pretty healthy to not be on drugs, guys. When we look at this guy. Okay. There you go. You, because you're going to have family going, hey, it's not a trailer. Well, what is it then? It's, well, an overview of the gameplay. Yeah, it's a trailer for the game. That's what it is. They spoil the character. I know it's already been spoiled in leaks, but now they literally spoil it themselves on their own. Yeah, yeah, that's another point. They've spoiled the character. There's no surprise in the game. There's no surprise character in the whole game. This could have been a surprise in the game because you wouldn't have known about it until you actually... Yeah, that's another point. They gave away the fucking character. Yeah. I'm fucking trailer. I'm fucking sick of this, of people saying, we haven't seen enough of this guy. And then they fucking show more. And they oh, you showed too much! What do you mean, you idiot? They didn't fucking show anything of substance to the story from the opening of the story. They've shown the character that you fight at the end of the story that's supposed to be revealed to you during the game. It's not about revealing more or revealing less. It's about revealing the right fucking things. You reveal the opening. And then the opening is supposed to be cool and get you hooked for the game. So you're supposed to put a lot of characters into it, like Lasky and Palmer and all these people that should be in the fucking game, but they're not. We know they're not going to be in the game. They weren't in the game. And they show the Harbinger, who literally turns up... Like, she's in one cutscene and then turns up at the end of the game. That's it. They could have not spoiled that. That's all I'm saying. But apparently, I'm an idiot for saying they shouldn't keep something back hidden in the game. They should just show everything because that's what they ended up doing and there was nothing to show that's why it was such a bad story they had nothing to hold back because they had nothing to show they ended up showing this garbage Just pick it pick already what you want no 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 it's not about picking what i want it's about doing it correct doing it the right way what the fuck's going to happen and the harbinger is just a rip off of the fucking didact yes Again, correct. From Halo 4, they've just rehashed Halo 4. Well, this guy didn't play Halo 4, so he's not going to even comment, right? For story, and you've just replaced the fucking Didact with the fucking Harbinger. And, and again, the end of the game is exactly the same as Halo 4's story. Cortana is in the system and helps you beat the fucking Harbinger, just like Cortana is in the system, helps you beat the fucking Didact, right? It's the same exact fucking story from Halo 4. And I called that again before the game came out. I called this exact fucking thing right here. 
from the fucking leaks and from this fucking trailer. I figured that out already. But I don't know what I'm talking about, right? Yeah, they took the name right out of fucking Mass Effect. They did? Bruh. Bruh. What? what? So, <laughs> so you've not played Mass Effect either then? Because the Harbinger is like the main guy you go against, the main Reaper. So you've not played Mass Effect either? <laughs> they, oh took the fucking, they took the name out of Mass Effect. That's a fact. You haven't played Mass Effect, so you don't know what I'm talking about. Because you don't play video games. This is a fact. Like I said at the beginning. Design right out of fucking Destiny. They took the voice right out. He's, he's high on tea and crumpets. <laughs> yeah. Why are these guys... These guys must all be on drugs because they keep projecting. It's like they worship this guy who's on drugs. And then everybody who they're against is apparently on drugs. So they see it as negative. They see it as a negative that someone's on drugs, but they worship this guy that's on drugs. It's really retarded. <laughs> a fucking King Gears of War. And they took this fucking story and plot from fucking Halo 4. What no! Happened? Which they did. To the Warden Anal. No. What happened to the Didats? Oh, we killed him in a book. Yeah. Genius move that was, wasn't it? When you bring back the same exact fucking plot with a different character. You don't even know the fucking story of this game. Except I do, because I read the leaks, watched this fucking thing, knew all about it, and predicted everything accordingly. Everything I said came fucking true. Again, I was right. What do you mean I didn't know anything about it? I was literally 100% correct once again before the game came out. Where's the apology? Game. Is that it? Is that it? Is that what's got two million views? Really? That <laughs> you wish you had two million, but you I mean It doesn't matter what I've got. I'm not fucking Microsoft Halo's big fucking thing. And with two million views, that's what they fucking shown us, and it's fucking garbage. Like you say, it's all hype, it's all bullshit. Thousands and it's not too bad for you, but <laughs> Um, what do you mean? It's not too bad for you. Look, if I had like this many views, right, that you've got and this many subscribers that you've got, okay, it would be a lot worse if I was talking crap, if I was making an arse of myself. But you have done it in front of the whole fucking world here with fucking this many views and fucking subscribers, right? You're making an ass of yourself in front of way more people than I ever could. Yet I'm saying things that are correct. I've been proven right through this entire thing. So how embarrassing is it to be your fucking sad ass when you're always fucking wrong? And refuse to admit that you were wrong. You wish you had, had two million. I, know I don't give a rat's ass. I don't want your retarded fa fan base because they're all idiots as we've clarified here. They didn't even play Halo when it came out. Like self. They're all a bunch of fucking dildo-loving goofballs that want dildo skins in all the games. I don't want fucking fan base like that. I want genuine fucking Halo fans, genuine Gears of War fans, genuine gamers, real fans. Not these fucking goofballs who like free-to-play garbage. I don't want those people. I don't care. I do. It's the trailer. I mean, like, why even say that? What's that going to do with anything? Honestly, my brother didn't steal my girlfriend. That's far worse than anything you can say to me. Is everyone trying to kill you? This guy's with you for the whole game. Leaks. Well, we don't even know. We, we don't know. Oh, 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 we don't know. But who just said that he's with you through the whole game after I'd read the leaks? And who was correct about him? Uh, me. Me, I was correct about him being with us through the whole game. Yes, that's correct. What I just said again is a fact. Hope he's there for the whole game. Yes, we do, because I just told you it was a fact, and it became a fact. Here you go. But I'm gonna assume he is based on. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna assume he is as well. So why are you challenging it then? What do you mean we don't know? On his 
role of delivering you weapons and vehicles. Really? So I'm right then? Amazing. Broom, fucking broom. How exciting. Play day one with Game Pass. We're fucked. That, that is terrible. What? <laughs> Honestly, like, I'm, I'm legit serious. No, <laughs> really. There's going to be people saying I'm saying this just to make views and stuff. Like, I'm dead serious. It is absolutely terrible. Well, you heard him. He's not joking. He's serious. Like, how can you... And who was right, Fratangi? You big fucking goof. You get excited for this. Well, um... Just go and play Gears of War 5. No. Just, just go and play fucking Far It's not Cry a first-person shooter. It's the same game. It's the same thing. You go around on a fucking map and collect shit. It's the same fucking game. No, it's not. It's not a first-person shooter. On a... It's the same map. Go and do something. Do that. How dare and then they? there'll be a main objective. How dare they? Yeah. That's not what Halo fans want. You're an idiot. And you don't like it either because you haven't played it for three months. That main objective will actually progress the story and all the other fucking shit around there will just be for garbage, grind. Well, I mean, g games are supposed to have progression. <laughs> Is that a problem now? Yeah, it's a problem because they're making all the fucking games Assassin's Creed fucking 3. It's the same fucking game over and over. Collect shit, move over and collect more shit for no fucking reason. Don't even do anything. What do you mean? Why can we not have an opinion that that gameplay sucks ass? Why? What? What is the problem with that? There's nothing special about it. It's been done a million times. Yet this guy, I, I, apparently, he's attacking me over not liking fucking the same shit that I've played a million times before. Probably because he hasn't played any fucking video games himself, so doesn't realize how many of these fucking games there are that he can play right now. I can give him a whole fucking list and he can play him for the rest of his fucking life. That's how many there is. Is it, is it a problem to have progression in games now? Two dollars from creepy people. You know exactly what I'm talking about. I'm talking about the open world bullshit. Hello? You've just watched the video. Get off the drugs, man. You picky for games they want to play? I know. Achievements, pointless fucking walking off and going and fucking killing so many fucking of them uh, power plant things they just showed or AA guns or whatever. Irrelevant stuff. Here's the video. That's the game. Where's the video? We had Halo 1, amazing fucking levels. Halo 2, amazing levels. Halo 3, some shit levels, and then half the rest of the second half of the game, the Ark, the Covenant, the fucking amazing levels, right? Now we got this. This garbage, this is what you... He must have thought he was real clever when he wrote this. This is how you're trying to reboot. Look at how that's fucking aged. Reboot the franchise? This garbage? If I turn it into a fucking Far Cry fucking clone? That's that's the idea? With the same shit Call of Duty gameplay from the previous game? The same do you not, garbage do not ever compare this to Call of Duty ever again. Why? When it's got the same fucking gameplay? The same way that Halo 5 had the same gameplay as Call of Duty? Because Ryan Darcy said that he worked at 343 in 2016. So how is that Call of Duty gameplay when they literally copied Call of Duty? But you wouldn't know that because you don't know who Ryan Darcy is because you're not a Halo fan. You didn't watch that fucking shit. You didn't fucking learn about Halo 5. You didn't learn about anything. You didn't play Halo 5. So what are you talking about? Shit, shit from the previous game? With no fucking Forge at launch? No fucking co-op at launch? It's a shit game. Still not in the game. Game, you can't even yeah. play it with your friends. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Shit game, you can't even play it with your friends. That is a fact to this day. I haven't played it yet. I, 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 and that's a fact. To this day, that's a fact. And it is a shit game. And I predicted it was a shit game, and it is. You haven't played it yet. Well, yeah. Well, you played it, and now it's terrible, right? So, where's the apology? You can't even enjoy it with your friends. You can't True even, story. It, like, poke fun at it. Well, I mean, people can. I mean, you say it like you were going to enjoy it anyway, but you're not. Well, how are you going to enjoy it with your friends if you can't play it with your friends, Einstein? 
It's a bit of a difficult one to do, isn't it? Two from Crappy Post. Irrelevant stuff like his opinion. Everything I said came true. Whoever said that. Just so you know, you're an idiot too. With a, with a few friends. Sadly, you have to the chat sit down in a room available. on your own and actually commit the time to actually play in this by yourself. And it's garbage. And there's nothing to it. I literally just bought a Nintendo Switch. For what? And Mario Golf has more depth to it than this game. True fucking story, man. <laughs> He's gonna take that literally. That's hilarious. Um... I'm losing it. <laughs> he's, gonna t he's taking it literally. It was a fucking joke. He's taking it literally. Dad, I'm losing it. <laughs> <laughs> this is some what? fucking good bait. What a fucking clown. It. My lord. <laughs> this guy's losing it. What a clown. From Crazy Cracker 831. Did he just tell what a to fucking clown. Instead of Halo Infinite? Rev's chainsaw bait. <laughs> yeah, he did. He can't even make it, a though, joke. Crazy Cracker. Like, there's nothing here. Nothing here. There isn't. Just like Brit. <laughs> just like, just like England. There's nothing here. <laughs> I have absolutely no idea that that was a retarded statement as well. Yeah, what the fuck the hype is surrounding this game? I have no idea. Like even no the internet idea. hype. I know there's no fucking hype in reality because reality. the people I've spoke to who used to play fucking Halo who don't fucking play it anymore are not coming fucking back. They're all like, "Where's the fucking co-op at launch?" I played co-op. All, all the people, you know. I mean. Yeah, man, because, you know, I've been playing this shit since, you know, 2001, so I've built up a lot of fucking people that I know in real life and online, and they weren't happy that no co-op at launch. That's everybody that I spoke to about it, okay? And there's still no fucking co-op, and now it's fucking exploded, and now even you're pissing and moaning about it. They've gone and cancelled split screen co-op. How is 343 still getting funding for anything? You see? It's, you, you're saying that shit now. Where were you saying it before fucking launch, hmm? Einstein? Hmm? Real smart, aren't you? Real smart looking now. Ejecting drugs into your eyeballs every day. Well, how, where's it got you? Nowhere. The game sucks. It failed. And you're an idiot and will always be remain an idiot for all time. Because this video will be available for all fucking time. Share this fucking video. Every time this goof opens his mouth... Share this fucking video. That's all you got to do. Download this video, upload it, and share it to him again. Because that's all you've got to do. Because this guy is always fucking wrong. Damn. If only that was reflected in the popularity of the game and its success. All the way through. With my well, it will be. And it is. And it has. We've seen that. A brother, now I can't fucking play it. Blah, blah, blah. You're still gonna buy it! You're still gonna- First of all, I didn't buy this game. It came with my Series X, so that's bullshit. And second of all, I have free Game Pass. And I've got free Game Pass again. It cost me £60 for fucking three years Game Pass that I've just renewed, right? Because I'm not an idiot, right? £60 for three years Game Pass. That's less than I used to pay for Xbox Gold for a fucking year. So how the fuck am I buying these games? This is insane. Microsoft is giving their games away for fucking free. Unless you're a complete and utter fruit, then you're not going to buy the game, are you? So it makes no sense what you've just said at all. I'm still going to buy the game. What do you mean? I didn't buy the game. The game came with my console for free. No, but play it. And you're still going to test it out. Shut up. Uh, yeah, cause I, only because I wanted to review it. And it came fucking free. And I've got free Game Pass. I got it two ways for free. I wouldn't spend fucking $60 on a fucking campaign. Are you fucking shitting me? They can shove that up their fucking arse. I w if that was the case, if it wasn't like Game Pass or free on my console or whatever, I wouldn't have played this game. No fucking way. That's what's happening. It's not, it's not oh, well, I'm coming back. Let's go. It's fucking Halo. No, they don't give a fuck. It's not happening. Correct. Most of the people that used to play Halo with me do not play Halo anymore. Fact. Because the game isn't Halo anymore. Fact. Dead. So what... But even the internet hype, I don't understand. There's nothing there. There's nothing there to be excited about. Just like your about. country. 
It's about as generic what, as... What is this anti-British bullshit, man? It's like, where are you even from, man? I don't even know, and I don't fucking care. You're just an idiot. Like, you could you could be from anywhere. It doesn't matter. You're just an idiot. There's idiots everywhere in the world. You're proving that right now. As it gets. Yeah. It couldn't be any more generic if it tried. It's so... A British person trying to call the land. What is this British hate bullshit, man? <laughs> but these guys, if you say anything about anybody else, it's like, oh, you can't say that. These guys are fucking completely delusional fucking psychos, man. Gapes up of Halo fucking generic. That's a good one. It's like psychos, man. An example of how to be generic. It's the model to follow from now on if you want to be generic. It is story. generic beyond generic. I'm not saying, like, Halo 5 was a good game, but this game is worse. It, it just worse. You have it. True story. It is worse in a lot of ways. And I, I've been proven right on that. That's always the argument. Oh, you haven't played it yet. Yeah, but I predicted Halo 5 was going to fail, and I predicted this game was going to fail. Guess what happened? What did you predict? That it was going to be amazing... Blah, 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 the hype was justified, blah, 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 and now you're fucking bashing it. So, you were wrong. Admit you were wrong. Apologize. Every it. single way. And that takes some freaking doing. Frickin that dude. takes some next level fucking design choices, man. It's almost done. Oh, fuck. Halo 5 had co-op at freaking launch. Man. True story. Halo 5, you could play co-op. Day one. I don't care if Halo 5 had it at launch. Halo 5 sucked. <laughs> A game you've never played. <laughs> Out of the freaking box. And this game does And Halo Infinite sucks. So it's instantly worse. True story. No. That's not how that works. That is exactly how that works. It's got less features at launch. That's exactly how that works. Out of the box, day one, you can't play co-op. That's instantly worse than the previous game on paper. Regardless of whether you enjoy playing it more or not, you literally have no way of playing co-op at launch. That is instantly worse. That's a fact. That's how that works. Instantly worse because... Having... Having those things by default does not make Halo 5 better. <laughs> well, it, it does, yeah. On paper. And Halo Infinite worse by default. On paper, it does. Fucking Halo 5 launched with those things that people wanted in that game sucked. Halo 5 had a shit launch anyway, but that's beside the point. The point is it has features that this game still doesn't have. And now you're pissing and moaning about it. But you weren't saying that before launch. Because because of the Far Cry over fucking map, like, and that's the fucking game. And this is this is supposed to be hype. This is the fucking. This is Microsoft's only exclusive in the last two years. This is the game. What? No, they just had Forza. Um... Forza doesn't count if you're a real Xbox fan, and you don't even play Forza. We can bring that up right now. I brought it up at the beginning of the video. King Frash owned him on this. He doesn't even play that shit. Where is that shit? He had Forza, didn't he? What, this Forza? This Forza here? This one? The one that you don't play? That you don't care about? Like the rest of us? But you pretend to like it? That one? Doesn't count, brother. No one cares about fucking Forza. That's not an exclusive that anyone cares about. Nobody cares about Forza. Moving on. They said Forza, right? They had Flight Sim, okay? Flight Sim? Flight Sim is not a fucking Xbox exclusive. It's garbage. That's not, that doesn't even count. Flight Sim is not even a game. It says it in the name. It's Flight Simulator. It's not a game. Forget it. That's not an exclusive. This is fanboy territory. You're trying to make out games are fucking real exclusives when they're not even fucking exclusives that matter they're not real exclusives that's like going on, on playstation and saying stray it's like no one cares about stray death loop no one gives a rat's ass about that either i'm talking about real exclusives okay yeah you can have some shitty ones too but i'm talking about real exclusives here okay 
This is Xbox's only real exclusive. I have Halo, Halo. All, right. all right? So, uh, that's like, what, three, three fucking games in, a, in one three. year? That's, uh, that's good. <laughs> that's terrible. That's terrible. The 360 used to have like six in a year. Every year, without fail, and spread out across the year. So what are you talking about? We had like Mass Effect, Saints Row, all shit. The real Saints Row, not this garbage we got now. Exclusives. Elder Scrolls. Shit like this was exclusive when it came out. These guys are hard with it. It's all about real exclusives, not fucking from fours. It doesn't count. Hasn't counted for a long time. This is the garbage. Tell you what, man. Don't don't expect a review. That's oh, what I'm gonna say. Go. Oh, don't thank expect good. a fucking review. Whew, thank God. Good. Feel free to subscribe. See you. Yeah. Well. That's, not, that's the only thing I've got wrong in this whole fucking thing is that I actually did end up reviewing the game. Everything else I said was correct. There you go. Amazing. So when's the apology coming for Tango? Bro. World I... Uh, that's it? Oh my god. Wow. Wow. Never again. Never again. So he doesn't watch the, the reference at the end where we've got some guy with the fake hype and the delusion. In Ubernick. So there you go again. You haven't finished the video. Watch the video. Again, will like click on this guy's channel? That was fucking. Well, you will have to now because I'm going to talk about you. I'm going to talk about you more. This isn't the end of it. If you continue to push this narrative that you were saying Halo was fucking shit from day one, I'm going to call you out. Incessantly. Terrible. Halo 5 got an 85 Metacritic. Yeah, but it's. I don't know. That was not good. <laughs> um, let's check out the comments. People said to check by newest. Let's see what happened. Jesus! Spammed already. Proof. <laughs> oh, Lord. Let's, ref let's refresh this video. Let's see what's going on. Okay, so I've had a number of requests. <laughs> not that bad. He'll recover. He'll recover. He's good. Newest, oh, newest, newest one. Fine. All right. B well, from. You, well, you trying? You trying to say I've been destroyed by your retarded fans? Like they can't touch me, man. I seriously don't give a fucking rat's ass. The same shit happened with Halo Five. I was right. Same shit happened with this game. I was right. You idiots are always wrong, and that's all there is to it. And the fact that you think I give a rat's ass about dislikes, every single time one of you idiots comes and dislikes, that's another view on the video. So I really don't give a rat's ass. And that's just common sense. England, Halo's landscape is boring. Pick they don't do sure. anything. <laughs> oh my god. This is too fun. This is just too much fucking fun. Well, it's it's going to be fun when you watch this back, isn't it? And have a fucking panic attack because I fucking destroyed your ass. I mean, like, just totally fucking, like, buried your ass at every turn. It's like, you've literally said nothing that made any sense. In, in fucking how many hours here? Like, this is retarded. Oi. I'm the next mullet. <laughs> Imagine if I had the kind of time this guy does to fucking do this all the time, man. I could destroy these fools every fucking day. But, you know, I actually have a life, so I don't have time for this shit. But imagine if I had no life like these guys, man. I could destroy these motherfuckers every day. For fun. <laughs> Ten dollars from uh, from Wimpy. Love you, Frit. Keep it real, bro. Yes, sir. Hey, you keep it real and keep that money in your wallet and uh, save it for a rainy day. I think you've done enough, good sir. It has been fun. I'm done. I'm fucking done. I gave you guys Thank a total Christ. of what, fucking three, four videos that I'm worn out. That King Thrash video took so much out of me. And he owned your ass as well over Forza, like we've discussed. You didn't even play it as much as he did. And he says it's a bad game and you're defending it when you don't even play it. It's hilarious. If you love the game so much, you would have more gamer score on it. And we've seen the gamer score. You don't even care about Forza. This is the retarded thing with you. You defend shit and, you know, attack people over shit you don't even care about. It's really fucking telling, man. Like, you don't even understand Halo 5 or anything. You don't know anything about it. 
saying there's like a QTE sequence in it and stuff. It's like you don't know anything. You haven't played those games. You called the fucking Brute Chopper a scorpion. You have nothing. You're not a Halo fan. It's embarrassing. Stop talking about fucking Halo and I'll stop talking about you. That's all I've got to say. Keep that shit out of your mouth. Go and stick to your PC and stop playing Xbox games because it's fuck all to do with you. You don't even play Xbox. You're a PC guy, right? Supposedly. Yet you defend Xbox to the hilt over Forza and fucking Halo Infinite. Two shit-ass games. Oh my, oh my god. god. It took so much out of me. I'm exhausted. Oh, Lord. Anyways. Anyway. Let's call it a good night then, huh? Well, fine. Let's look good at the console one time and see what's going on. Okay, so about a number of... Okay, so about a number... What are you doing? The video is over. New. Nah, nothing new. All right. Well, <laughs> the King Thrash one was fucking hilarious. He's he's the he's for sure mad. All right, everybody. Mad, but he was it's correct. It's been fun. I want you all to have yourselves a good, lovely night. And I'm volcanoed out. Oh yeah, one hundred percent volcanoed out. Get off the drugs, man. Oh my God, I I gotta be careful when I walk around, or I'll trip over some foliage. <laughs> foliage yeah <laughs> good night any good nighting everybody good nighting uh go to bedding and i'll see you in um <laughs> what an embarrassment i'll see you the next day is. two dollars from wimpy now you pulling in alex oh fuck all right wimpy i'm not gonna ever deny your money but thank you <laughs> dude it's 253 yeah i know i'm tired tomorrow's friday the stream was amazing. It was. It was. It was the best stream. Oh my god. You're gonna King regret Crash doing this stream. Hilarious. You're gonna regret it now, aren't you? Now okay. that I responded. Buenas noches. Vayanse a la cama. Y los veo el otro día. And for all my white guy. mofos, I will see you guys tomorrow. I think. We'll see how. Yeah, so this guy is a complete and total retard. I hope you enjoyed the video. And I'll see you next time for more. Um, exposing of these retards. Oh. Hi, it's a kite, everybody. Goofballs. <laughs>